edition of Jay's Phantasmagorical Adventures through Twitch. Yes, Jeb, that's right. Jay is tired of not being able to murder hobo everyone, so we're going back to Cowboy Dolly Land. wondered if Jay would steal a train and ride it all around the map murdering mercilessly, Lily. You'll get your answers this even. Chaotic neutral, lawful evil, horse stealer. Jay could be anyone and all of one of these. Chat, this is your dead reminder about the pandemic, but more importantly than that, ra ba ba ra kukun ra ba ba ra ba ba ra ba ba ra ra ba ra ra ba 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 ra ra ba ra kukun And so, Chad, sit back, relax, as we play Cowboy Dolly Simulator Red Dead Redemption DOS. Today, on Jay's Phantasmagorical Adventures, uh, through Twitch. Little bit early with the orange. Little bit early with the orange, because I'm going to be out. I'm going to be out from under this orange uh, pretty quickly now. I'm going to be pretty free from this orange. Uh, a little... A little early, uh, Tom. To my You're job, doing it, though. Where I sing like a cat. You're doing it. You're beginning to believe. Funky wow. government approved music plays in the background. You wouldn't download a horse. I would download a horse, actually. I was right. My lights were a bit too big. Too big? Too bright? Uh, and yeah, Dunk, uh, Dunk, you need to be careful because the orange arty will come after you. Yeah. The orange arty will come after you if you keep fucking up this orange, okay? Okay, they will come after you. Jay, quick reminder you requested, don't steal a train and murder everyone. Mm. No promises. I have to time the orange because I get stream delay. Look, honestly, Dunk, it's fine by me because it means less orange for me. Okay? I'm just saying, chat might lynch at you. Okay? Chat might... Do you know what I mean? Yeah. The citrus service... That's a little bit too close to clitoris service. I'm just, I'm just saying. Okay, Jay, quick reminder. You wanted to steal a train and murder everyone. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. You're looking good today, Jay. Is it my haircut? I look thinner because I had my haircut. Hang on. It's, it's very short. It's very short. Very short indeed. It's mainly because, right... I have to have a week between haircut, same with the beard, right? A haircut and then a little beard shave for a week. And then like a week after haircut is when like the sweet spot for my hair. <laughs> Couldn't get it cut just before the BAFTAs. That's not right. I have to get it cut, you know, to get the right amount of growth. Yeah. You wanted to steal everyone and murder trains. Thank you, Sid. Thank you. Oh, I said I was wearing my twat t-shirt earlier on. Here you go. Twat. T. Wait. T W. At. Twat. Hit me. I've got another one also from MB, Imbri, uh, with a W and, a, and an anchor. Yeah. Wisdom from my granddad. What's the difference between a good haircut and bad haircut? About three days. Actually, that's right. That's actually uh, baseball. Uh, you just used bits for something useful and educational and accurate. I, don't, I feel uncomfortable, okay? I feel uncomfortable. I have my GPU. Yeah, I do. I do. It's just in my cupboard back here, actually. Yeah. I intercepted it. Just for shits and giggles. I went all the way to Germany. I was like... I'll have that then. I'll have that. Yeah, yeah. That's all I ever use them for. What the fuck are you talking about? Sorry. Sorry, baseball. I forgot. Okay? Sorry. <laughs> Sorry for missing the RP stream. I should hope so, Luck. 
Um, what, what kind of excuse? Missing a stream? That's um. I mean, honestly, I should ban ban you. Anybody that misses a stream, no, I'm not allowed back in. I mean, I'm very upset about this. As you know, Lug, this is this is your gainful employment. Viewing my streams, I expect you to appear on time and not moan about the pay. Okay. Okay, just say. Yukina, I would like a random fact. Okay. Uh, in 2036, I slapped the Prime Minister of America with a salmon. Yeah. Yeah. Lol, what pay? Again, again, Yukina, I'll just come over to the side here. Okay, so Yukina, um, this is called satire, right? Uh, or parody. So the joke is in the fact that we all know that there isn't pay, right? And that's the joke. So it's like, be happy with the pay. There isn't any pay, huh? See, so they should be happy receiving nothing, right? That's that's the joke in there. So when you go, what pay? That you're sort of, you're ruining what we call comedy. Um, just something to bear in mind, you know. Um, and sarcasm, unless you write it really well, um, doesn't come across in text. Um, okay, we'll go. We'll go back over to the rest of the group now. But it's just, it's just something to think about. Okay, okay, right. Hi, gang. Sorry, Jory. I just had to have a quick chat with Lukina, you know, all private like. Yeah. I saw a hockey game when someone threw a fish in the ring so that it wouldn't be, so that wouldn't be too surprising. That was also me, actually. Yeah. I was hiding the evidence. Yeah. That was, um, that was hiding, hiding the evidence. The pay is literally negative because people give money. No, they don't. I've never seen that happen. I've never seen that happen. It's a tradition at Red Wing Games to toss in an octopus. What? Why are you tossing octopuses? Do you toss the octopus off? I'm not going to apologize for that. I'm not going to apologize for that. A hockey thing when things don't get thrown is more... Wait do, wait, do they throw it? Are they throwing it just like during play? Is it like we're part of this too? Let's trip a man with an octopi. Just like middle of the... Like not at the end in celebration. Sometimes yes. So you'll sound very poorly behaved. But you're not raised properly. Sounds like a very, very bad way to behave. Do you not have manners in America? I, I answer my own question. It's fine. I joined the air fryer gang today. Air fryer is the shit, okay? If you want... Okay, Yukina, come come over here. Um, Okay, so again, where I tailed off and looped back round, that was, that was me doing the, if you have to ask, you know, I, I was... I was showing that I already knew that my question was redundant because I answered it in the first part you've seen. Um, again, just keep keep practicing it. Um, I'll keep throwing these to you uh, and see if you can get one to land. Okay, let's go. Let's go back to the group. Hi, hi, chat. Sorry, sorry. I exist in sarcasm. It was my first language. I mean, sarcasm. I, sarcasm sometimes feels like sarcasm and irony is like the national language of the UK, I feel. I feel. Yeah. Wow, I'm getting a lot of extra attention today. I'm not sure why. Ha, oh, come on. Come on, Yukina. Just over here again. No, oh, come over here. Okay, so the reason you're getting extra attention today is what I'm doing is I'm using your text prompts to kind of do a bit where we go off to the side, but obviously chat can still hear us because I've got a fucking microphone. But it's like a little, little, little skit we're doing, you and I, right? And then I'll pretend and we go back to the group. So that's, that's the source of this attention. Okay. Oh, okay, good. Okay. All right. Hi, chat. Sorry. Sorry, me and Yukino, we're just workshopping something. Yeah. 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 If you want a good sausage, air fry is where it's at. You will never have a better sausage than an air fried sausage. Okay, leave Yukina alone. I'm giving Yukina priceless acting glasses. You shush. You shush. You'll know when I'm bullying somebody. All right. You'll know when I'm bullying somebody. All right. Um, yeah, air fried sausages and air fried bacon. It's basically air fryers are the best thing for a, a fry up. I'll be honest. That's how you do it. Yeah. Yeah. 
I'll be honest, I mainly got it for the hash browns. Oh, oh hash browns. Oh, oh. Air fried nuggies. Got gold nuggies. Yeah, hash browns, bacon, sausages. Um, but I re like we've only got the single tray ones, and I really want. A it's not even that big, and I'm like, oh, shit. Now that we've had an air fryer, I'm like, yeah, I want one of the dual tray ones that also sinks. So if you put two different things in, you can set the time so that it finishes at the same time and it figures it out for you. Oh, oh! Imagine how quickly I could spin out a fry up, chat. Imagine how quickly I could spin out a fry up. I fucking love it. I need it. The idea of cleaning an air fryer after making bacon. No, you're right. Okay, so here's the tip. Silicon molds. For most brands of air fryer or just generic silicon molds, you can get. So you, you put the silicon mold in the tray, put the bacon in that, and then all you do is just rinse out the silicon mold and chuck it in the dishwasher. It done. Yeah. Tom air fries cereal. Tom does a lot of things to a lot of different foods. Yeah. 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 Will you still need me? Will you still feed me when I'm 64? <sighs> Just rinse it out with a hose. What the fuck? Now baseball. <laughs> a hose over here is a word that's used almost exclusively for the garden hose are you suggesting i take my air fryer tray out into the garden and just like that get the pressure washer out yeah also my mobility is impaired so bending down to an oven is just too difficult these days that's smart that's very smart i love air fryers they're great yes yeah, same here why are you hosing off kitchen utensils you fucking psychopath i'm too angry don't get me angry now Am I sorry, but are we am I about to discover that Americans are regularly cleaning their kitchen equipment with garden hoses? Just It's a joke, Jay. A joke is where you say something that takes things somewhat out of the normal expectations for the purposes of comedy. Yeah, but I normally expect Americans to be fucking stupid, so it doesn't work, does it? If it's believable, it doesn't work. <laughs> Get the dual compartment air fryer. Yeah. I does wants one. I does wants one. Well, stop generalizing, you racist. I will stop when America stops being dumb, okay? Do you have to censor yourself because the YouTubes are upset with you? Um. All right, come over here. <laughs> no, occasionally I do it for comedic effect. And then occasionally I'm doing it so that maybe, um, maybe YouTube will leave me alone. Yeah. Um, okay, oh mother, I will try this mumbly, but my throat is a little sore. Not sore, you know, it's dry. Like a desert. My tummy is especially rumbly, and it's making my brain think all jumbly. This poem is bad, and my rhyming is bad. Another dumb limic from mumbly, um, oh mother. I wasn't too bad. It was all right. I could just about get through it. I just about get through it. I just bring the air fryer into the shower with me using the hoses a bit much. <laughs> Most humans are stupid as well. Oh, I had to deal with a stupid human the other week. Oh, I say the other week. The other, the weekend just gone. I can't believe. Joe, this guy, this was, this guy was so stupid. I'm going to have to draw it for you, chat. I'm going to have to draw it for you. Look, let's come over here. Let's come over here. All right. Let me show you via the medium of paint. Okay. How, how, how fucking idiot this guy was. Okay. So let me paint you a picture. Okay. So uh, I came to a crossroads. Okay. So you basically got, got this kind of setup. Okay. Okay. Um, and there was, there was traffic lights you know, controlling all the flow of of traffic in each direction. Okay. Now, somewhere down here, I would I would guesstimate uh probably like half a mile maybe. Uh there was a there was a very bad accident. Very sad. You know, or very sad accident. 
about half a mile down here like a good couple of minutes drive down here now i was coming along in my automobile and i came here mm, eh, and i pulled over the traffic lights and the lights went green mm, and i carried on over here okay uh there was a guy in the queue here who was waving down all of the traffic coming coming this way to tell all of them of this accident down here Right, it was oh yeah you don't want to there's a big smash that way you don't want to go that way it's an accident welcome to my show so where i sing like a cat thank you Decker bear for 47 months Decker, much appreciated um so i was like yeah okay cool um but i kind of i just wanted to see how bad it was i didn't know if the road was closed so i'm like i'm gonna go and investigate um so i carried on drowned carried on down okay and yeah sure enough a little further along uh, there was actually another crossroads like this. There was a big smash on the crossroads, but there was a little layby here. So all of the traffic was coming down, turning around in the layby, and heading back up this way. Okay, we all following so far. So basically, up here, loads of space, and the traffic was just turning around and coming back down. Now, when I when I got back to these crossroads, okay, the guy that was here. And had been waving at everybody to uh, tell them that there was an accident up ahead. Had taken it upon himself to take his car and turn it and block this lane of his own accord. Okay? Of his own accord. So what was happening now is traffic from all of the other directions was coming across here and trying... This is a civilian, yeah, and trying to turn. Okay? But he's blocked it and the traffic is queued here. So they all they are now is they're just sat in the middle of this junction because they can't turn down here. So then the traffic coming this way is like, well, fuck, I can't get through either. And he's on his phone and he's chatting away and he's waiting. Like, and a van comes across this way and he stops them in the middle of the junction. And he's like, yeah, no, don't want to go down there, mate. There's uh, traffic. So I'm just I'm stopping the traffic. And then like so only like one car at a time is managing to get through here because everybody's stuck in this just fucking hellhole of traffic misery here while mr smart citizen is trying to help out which i applaud well done you for trying to help however you're fucking moronic so i get to here where he's parked up and i lent out and i just went i just bless him though because i just lent out i went mate I'm an ex-cop. You're causing 10 times more traffic than you're solving. They've got it sorted down there. Get your car out the way. And it was like, oh, have they? Oh, all right. And then I, I carried on my merry way this way and he moved his car off. And what do you know? Traffic started flowing. Because some people, there's like, you know, there's like a shop here and a farm off here. And some people are like, I just want to go here. Get the fuck out of the way. So yes, I, I educated him that maybe his... Uh, his idea wasn't the smartest, chap. But I was just like, how do you not... How do you sit at that junction and be like, I'm helping this situation. I'm definitely not causing more traffic by parking here. And I was like, mate, if if they wanted to stop traffic coming down this junction, they wouldn't have closed the, the road a mile down. They would have come here and closed the road, okay? Bless, bless his heart. Bless his heart, exactly, chat. Yeah. Did I spot a cipher in chat? Can we get a shout out for cipher, please? Um, Decker, thank you very much for 47 months. The irony being, yeah, if he caused another accident. Just like preventing crime by standing on a porch, you know. Ooh. I'm the main character syndrome. It was a little bit. Like, like good on him for trying to help out, but I don't know if it's just the police officer in me, chat, but it's always what I end up doing. I, rem I remember, like, another time, like, there was an accident and all the traffic getting diverted the other way it was like a really steep hill where sometimes you could only get one car past and all that happened was traffic coming up and down this hill just stopped and all parked and i'm i'm thankfully at the top of the hill and i'm just like oh, for fuck's sake okay so i got out of the car straight on the phone to the highways agency and the police i'm like blah 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 you need to get a diversion in place it's causing loads of trouble here and then dickhead me i'm like okay right you three stop there you two da -da 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 -da. and then basically just managed all the traffic to clear them all out but all that was happening in the middle was just like 10 lemmings wandering around going oh we're all stuck in we're all stuck in traffic um 
Oh, this is, we should call the police, maybe. Oh, what if? Oh, is that is that your is that your car? Is that oh? Is that um? Oh, oh um. I'm just like, let's go. Let's do decisive action. Let's actually get something done. Wanted to tell you, just got them all off the porch. Did he set it on fire? I might start doing that. Just throw Molotovs. Go and do a murder. <gasps> Send something on the tip line saying bank robbery in different towns and then make them all run over there. <laughs> uh, for context, chat, in the Red Dead stream earlier on, I was getting incredibly frustrated because n the law were just sitting on porches in like two of the towns in the map. And it was very, very dull. And I don't understand it. So anyway, yes, people are stupid. That's the um, that's the long and the short of it. But today, chat, um, we are... <clears throat> oh, hi, Jess, doodles! Jess, thank you very much. Thank you very much for 15 months, Jess. Much appreciated. Um, so yeah, so basically, chat, I have um, I have sacked off Spider-Man from the schedule for a couple of reasons. One, I hate to say it, one of the simple things, numbers-wise, it doesn't do well on Twitch, and annoyingly, I have to have that as a little little demon on the shoulder, a little a little um consideration I have to give to it. Um, but also, quite a few people mentioned like it's fun to play, but it gets a bit samey to watch, which I totally get. Um, but what I think I'm going to do is carry on playing offline and record it and kind of do some chat while i play um and still stick the still still stick the vods up on youtube so there's still the full playthrough on youtube but we're gonna give over uh thursday nights to the single player of red dead redemption 2 so i can shoot people yeah yeah because i can't i can't do it in role play I can't, I can't do it on roleplay. Um, yeah, maybe I'll stick some Spider-Man VODs on for when I'm off um, doing my job. Ha! <laughs> maybe I'll do that when I'm doing my job. And then once we finish Pacific Drive on Monday, we're going to do Elden Ring. Um, try to get ready for um, for the DLC. Plus, I want to play Elden Ring again because it's just so fucking good. It's just so good. But I'm, I'll be honest, I'm really excited about the new, um, the next couple of weeks because it's been ages since I've been out to any um, industry events because of COVID and Millie and I were being super careful because obviously being voice actors, we don't want to get sick. So like this is, I'm going to a BAFTA social on Friday while I'm in London town doing something else. Then I got the BAFTAs next week and then a, a conference like the week after that, which I got to go fly off, which will be my first flight in like, six years or something as well which is very exciting chat it's very exciting so i'm kind of i'm very excited about the next few weeks it's gonna be good uh and yes tom new elden ring character um to get prepped for the dlc which i'm very excited about very excited about um but yeah i'm just excited to get out and see everybody again which is gonna be nice all right let's put us on uh red dead redemption 2 are you ready are you ready chat do you have any idea what kind of build? Not really. No. Because I'm a little confused because aren't they bringing in like new... Um... Hang on, is it going to give away all my personal details? Um, like they're bringing out some new classes before, I think, or in the DLC, aren't they? So I'm like, eh. I don't know how to play a class that doesn't exist yet, but that I can carry forward into the DLC. Does that make sense? I'm not I've not looked into exactly what what's going on with that I think it's just new weapon styles okay but yeah I will probably go uh, Dex I think like I did I did a magic build for my first playthrough and I honestly I think that's what spoiled the game for me so yeah, I don't think I'm going to go... I don't I'm think I'm going to go with the Dex build. Sorry, another mage build. Yeah. Because I think magic in the fur, in, in when Elden Ring launched was OP as fuck. So I found the game super easy. But I like the idea of like having a monk, maybe. Which would be cool. I'm having a blast with a faith build. That's like cleric right like holy spells and healing and stuff
Bap, 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 bap. I'm playing it more paladin. Gotcha. Faith, also, best character in Buffy. Ah! I got shot. I got shot, chat. But tell Jesus I got shot. Headoids. Elden Beast sword build. Oh. Oh. I know this is a sad thing to say, chat, but I am genuinely just looking forward to shooting somebody in this game. Because <laughs> you know, I don't get to do it on the roleplay server. Okay, let me just check. Does this pull in my... Okay, who knows how this works, chat? I basically want to ramp everything up to full. Triple buffering on. Quality. Ultra, 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 ultra. I'm just going to go through and put everything on ultra, and that'll do it, right? See, I don't want DLSS, do I? Or do I? Let's go for quality. Brightness. Uh, let's unlock these. Ultra, 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 ultra. On. High. Why not free frames? Because I was never sure if DLSS has an effect on image quality. On. Look, Cypher, look what you've allowed to happen. Look how much I can just turn everything up. And look how, like, it's still maybe a third of the, mem the menu. A third of the memory, even. Look at that. We're still not even half. <laughs> We're still not even halfway. I don't know. Is TAA sharpening good? I don't know. I'll leave that at like a third because I don't really know. I don't really like super sharp stuff because it looks weird. What does DLSS sharpening do? Uh, I'll put that up by one. Hi. Okay. Oh, wait, didn't that, did that change something else I've done down here? Which GPU am I using? Uh, 16 gig 4080. Okay. I think we're going to have to restart the game for this, though. Okay. I got to restart it just because I got a feeling, funny feeling that you need to. And yes, video memory is barely trying, which I adore. When did I buy it? I didn't buy it. I'm a very, very, very lucky man. And Cypher, um, who is in chat, Cypher of Tear, uh, very kindly sent me this 4080. And it's amazing. And yeah, vi the video memory is like, eh, whatever. I've still got like two thirds left. What else you got? <laughs> in fact, chat, we did the benchmark tests when I got this card. And it was like 120 frames didn't care solid solid as a rock very excited <laughs> ah chat my heart chat my heart now you can play cyberpunk 2077 i could i've never played it you can do it in VR as well. Cypher, I'm enjoying it so much. Thank you so much. It's so nice just to be just like, yeah, I'm just going to turn everything up to full and nobody cares. Uh, did I put a uh, refresh rate? Well, I think I want full screen, don't I? Oh, oh. Okay. Let me just double check audio. All good, all good. That's all full volume. Cool. By the way, you want to peek? What is this? Oh, no. Oh. See, chat? You see that weird thing that happens when I come out of a full, um, a full screen app? I think that's why I've left it on boarded. Oh, is this your PC sales? <gasps> Okay, that's sexy sales. That's sexy. It's missing a GPU though. How are you running a game without a GPU? <laughs> oh look, now it's gone back to windowed borderless. It's weird. I don't know why that happens. Okay, chat, you ready? You ready? This is like the third time I have started this game. 
And I promise I will try and finish it this time. Also, as with most, with, with most, oh my god. Okay, hang on. I gotta just set something off quick. Uh, time based. Mute warning. Toggle enabled. Okay, there we go. Because just like Spider-Man chat, if there's any like severe story moments or big speeches on on screen, I will um um I will be tabbing out uh of all the sounds. Yeah, this is continuing the game from where I was. Yeah, okay. We need to start a new game. Story. Jay, what? New game. There we go. Bro. Why? Well, I was just checking things worked. Calm down. Just a little kill. <laughs> That was my old game. You specifically told us to stop you. That's not the new game. It's fine. That was just a test, okay? That was checking your response time, chat. Well done. Well, I've uh, well done. Very good. You were very good. Yes. Just a little murder. Yeah, it's okay. They were a Tory. It's fine. Hey, Bert. Ah, Jesus Christ. Hi, Greedy. <gasps> Shh. By 1899, the age of outlaws and gunslingers was at an end. America was becoming a land of laws. Even the West had mostly been tamed. Few gangs still roamed, but they were being hunted down and destroyed. This is a story of one of those gangs. And a man called Arthur Morgan. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay, Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. It's weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he... You know... An old man in town. Abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! It begins, chat. It begins. Chapter one. Coulter. Bring him in here.
Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Five years old, chat, isn't it? Baby's this game. Dead. Six years old. There it's was insane. Nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this, just for a short bit, and I don't see what other choice we have. Listen, listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now we've had well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground in their stead, I'd do it gladly. But. We are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be, we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet, so. They both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. You. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey. Oh, it's so you gorgeous. Oh yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Bye. We need you strong. It's so insanely good, yes. chat. Oh, I turned my lights off because I wanted it to be moody. Ow, my eyes! All right. I'll tell you what, fuck Let's it. We'll have minimal out. overlay for this. Ain't sure what we're going to find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close and we'll do our best to stick to the trail. Give me my controls. There we go. Weather. Been two days or more like this now. It has to blow over soon. Careful over this bridge here. It's so interesting, like when you see the visual differences between this and uh, an RDO. I love you. I can't believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. No more, bud. We need to get those people warm and fed. Oh God, I've got a map. We don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. Okay. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. Hey, I think I see something up the path. Whoa. Shoot them. Shoot them immediately in the face. You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. I hate that guy. Like a party. No spoilers, chat, me. of course, for this for me. How's Davy doing? <clears throat> he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. But I hope That's Micah dies, and I hope Davey I get to kill him. 
Both of them calendar boys is, or <laughs> was, yeah. And Mac, Sean, you we don't know bring. quite a business. So pretty. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. I'm not. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. Coming past. Okay, go. And this is this is before. Um. You sure about this, Marcus? This is a prequel, Mr. isn't it? Morgan, I never thought I would be so pleased to see your face. Been kind of lonely out here. Where's everyone else? Old mining camp back up the hill, huddled around a fire, waiting for Daddy to put food on the table. Said it before, we got too many mouths to feed. Well, we got a few less now, so you should be happy. That ain't fair, Arthur. I earn my share. Do you? you think it's unreasonable to expect others to do the same? So, this house, you speak to the people there already? No, like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk to no one. Just following orders. You know me. I'm a good boy. Fuck you, my right. guy. The only other big gripe I had about this game was the UI. Like, to me, that UI in the bottom right means press the left click. But it's not. It's the right click. How much further? Not far. What does that mean? Not no, I haven't had anything ruined, PD. I don't know how this story Thanks. goes. Oh, goddamn, this snow gets right to the bone. Okay, let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Stop and stash those lanterns, boys. Let's do so two lie low on this. Oh, where are you go? Oh, okay. You shoot guns in the story, Jay. I don't have any guns. <laughs> okay. Let's head down there. None that it will let me take out at the moment anyway. Yeah, like I've seen various things on social media. Like I've got a rough idea of what might happen in the end. But yeah, please don't tell me anything. <clears throat> But I'm actually going to try and play Arthur as a good guy. I want to try and do like an actual lawful-ish playthrough. Like try and play him like he's Heath, maybe. Let's hitch up here. Whoa. Oh. Here you go. Stick him on there. Let me handle this. We don't want to spook these fine people. Like, look at this. This was so insane for the time when it came out. Like, these actual tracks Sounds through like the snow. The Jesus. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. You got a nasty-looking... In that cattle shed on the left. I could get down behind that wagon in front. Like, I will say this, with the 4070 and everything ramped up, it is very different. Hello? Shut up, Billy. Shh. Excuse me. Hello? Oh, well, hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into... Some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, oh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the Arthur, trail. we got a problem. 
There's a corpse right here. Well, shit. There's a body in the wagon. I hear you. Just keep your eyes on Dutch. Just go now, buddy. Chat. Don't bring the horses closer. Gotta let them all. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. No, but 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 uh, the loot Dutch. The loot. <laughs> God, it's such a good game. The music as well is exceptional. How have I never finished Arthur, this game? I'm coming. Keep your ear it's on, Dutch. Like party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We yeah, yeah, essential. all right. Food. Medicine, whiskey. I think the only other thing that that put me off uh, this game was I, got, I found it a bit confusing, like Get UI wise and everything. Bed. Like between tonics and food and everything else, I got real fucking confused. They'll beat up my satchel. I think it was I got confused between like provisions, tonics, ingredients. I don't know. I'm going to try it this time. And it's this. It's all the different cores. I'm like, I can't keep up with how many cores there are. All right, let's, uh, let's eat some uh, food here. I'm afraid, cringe. Yes. Well, the reason it says ish is because I've tried to play this game three times. I don't believe it. It's a strange one. Maybe they're hiding up here too. There's a big price. But on never got very far in it. Head. Yeah. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Wanting Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Well, let's have a look what's in this cabinet here. Yeah, I'll take a health cue. Thank you very much. Nice and dry and warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. I think as well, having played it, because I played the map in RP first as well, Cringe. Horses. You keep looking. So I already knew the map Grab and all that kind of stuff. We can use, then meet me out here. Oh, what's in the chest? General Miracle Liquid! Money, I like money. No, don't take- I want the cigarettes! Alright, then we searched. It's even things like this, right? Like, there's so much to search in each location as well. It is truly kind of amazing what they put together. Anything extra over here? Get swole with Alabaster's health liquid. Totally 100% genuine horse pubis. What's in the barrel? Where does the apostrophe go in Alabaster's analytics? Welcome to my show, where I sing like a cat. Uh, 
in the alabaster. So alabaster apostrophe. I'm coming. Keep your hair on, Dutch. Just give me a minute. <sighs> Micah. Time Arthur. to die. Keep looking for stuff. I... Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Yeah, but can I loot Micah, the corpses yet? Search the cabin. See what we missed. Sure. Oh, uh, no, the, the, adventure. the corpses are gone. All right. <laughs> Investigate the barn. Okay. Southwest of here, near the lake. It was too easy. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. I don't know anything else. Please, please spare me. I will find you. You won't see me again, Arthur. Just let me go. Come on. I'll see you again. I'll put you in the ground. Get the hell out of here. Go. No, I'm going to high honor playthrough. I'm gonna try to at least. Also, anonymous. Thank you very much for the gift uh, sub to cringe. Get my goddamn hat. All right. So it's it's that it's that weird mouse UI chat. It throws me every time. Right is the button it's trying to tell you to click. Easy. You're okay. Easy now. Whoa, now. Easy. Here you go. Gonna make Daddy Obi proud, yeah. You're all right, boy. Come on, let's go. You know, I'm gonna try to avoid murdering in cold blood. You know, that kind of thing. You let him go, huh? So I'm a little bastard. You need to hit him. Oh. He's already skittish. <laughs> God damn, Maka! Why up there, Gage? Leave her alone! I wasn't doing nothing. She's one of them O'Driscolls. No, she ain't, Michael. Look at her, Miss. Miss. Are you? Oh, you fool, Maka! Miss. Now. I hate this damn okay. prick. We mean you, no harm, Miss. Miss. Come on. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Come on now. Oh. Micah, you damn oh. fool. Are you okay, Miss? They came three days ago. Then my husband, they... Okay. Miss, you are safe now. And you can't stay here. You come with us. Let Micah burn. Yes. 
It's okay. We're bad men. We ain't them. It's okay. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Oh, it's See, Adler's ranch. Adler. Mrs. I... He... He was my husband. Oopsie. Springfield. Like Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Comb O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently, scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food. And this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something. And Mrs. Adler, it's going to be OK. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. Because he's not a racist prick, my car. Yeah, I'll just say uh, guess. <laughs> do you want to overwrite the data in this slot with you? Yes, I do. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know the situation were reversed and he looked for me oh, thank grumble, you grumble. this way last i know john was headed up the river for all we know he kept riding north and never looked back he wouldn't leave not like that uh, wouldn't be the first time Such a pretty game. Hey, I see some smoke. Come on, let's take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. Well, how to do it? Let's go. To the river. 
It's so weird. The horse controls are ever so slightly different as well. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Uh, it should only be the res, really, was. Like, you'll get it at 1080p 60, and I'm at 1440p. Arguably more frames, though, I guess. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way, but it was a bad situation. What you doing? Like him, though. Oh, God, no, Aragor. No, 100% not. Tracks go left, down here. Oh, so pretty, though. Davy got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Look at. Look at. Damn snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. I think it's a fictional part of America, basically, Yukina. Well, the trouble is, it's a different, completely different bit of software. Um, so every Red Dead roleplay server uses Red Dead Online, whereas this is a completely yourself, different application, which is why you can buy Red Dead Online and not have access to the single player. It's because they're two completely different bits of software. Come on, boy. Horses are struggling. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. I don't know about this, Javier. We, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Here, do it. Once, come on, Javier. Yeah, like if you want to do Red Dead roleplay oh, servers, you only need to buy Red Dead Online. It's like a much cheaper way of getting into Red Dead roleplay. Hey, look! <clears> over <throat> there! You see that? Yeah, goddamn bear horse. John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Real shit. Let's see if he can hear us. Come on. Up there. Come on. Let's go. Avalanche, anyone? Well, we found him and then immediately killed him. It went very well. from your horse who knows what's up ahead oh I, I vaguely remember this confusing the fuck out of me as well okay horse weapons tap tab no it's a right click no hold tab to view your stored weapons right there we go it's so confusing <laughs> it's so different to the uh the roleplay service. It gets real fucking confusing. I at least got a shotgun now. Hey, have you? You sure about this? John Marsden! It's coming from this way. Okay. It's slippery. Be careful. You too should be careful, Javier. You're telling me. Bad job. I didn't pull the trigger. I'm covering him. Watch yourself. He slipped on the mountainside. 
What a terrible shame. Also, Gobble, very much for picking up a channel t-shirt. Watch your head here. My name is Channel. Channel t-shirt. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you uh, enjoy repping. Okay, yeah. come here. I adore Watch Channel T-shirt. Real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up this way. Why is my stamina core empty? I don't think it must that you'll do me stamina. -mana. Eh, you're pretty good. Here you go. Come on. Soft, soft, soft. Come on. We're like, coming, John. Insanely pretty game. <laughs> Come on, John. John, you useless piece of shit. Let's go. <laughs> you climb worse than Scooter. Oh. Bong. God, it must have been so easy to Come get on. away with murder. John, can you hear me? Marston, you hear me? John, where are you? Marston! I'm here! Out on the ledge! That's we John! Could... We're coming! We could just Down shoot here. him. He fell and slipped. It was dreadful. Arthur doesn't get upset over potato right, children, though. Marston. But that makes him worse. Imagine not getting upset over your potato children. That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. Wow, rude. Die on a ledge, mate. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Pretty much gravity, yeah. Come <clears throat> on, compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's Where was he way. trying to go? That's what I want to know. Can't argue with you there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. Rude. I'm sure you did. Uh, you all right? I don't think so. Come on. It's a great shot, though. Well, goddamn. Rot row, Scooby. I'll distract him while you get to the horse. What? No. We'll draw him off. Okay, here we go, John. We'll get them to Arthur. Yeah, come on. Right here. Skin you, I can sell you for two dollars at the okay, butcher. See, how many hours did you put in just on the multiplayer? Oh, it'll be hundreds, Joe. Hundreds I've played on the multiplayer. Come on, boy. Come on, here, let's go. Let's get back to the others. Like, I've got a hundred hours on ranch, pretty much. I don't feel too good. And I've been playing on that be for fine. It's four just weeks. Like a, a dog bite. Uh, knew a fella. Got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. You reckon the thousand could be the thousands, to be honest, back in the wild days. Like I would stream eight hours a day, three or four days a week. You can step on uh you can check on Steam. Ah, oh, okay, ghouls. I know it says oh, I've got it's like 72 hours on uh, RDO. Get the hell out of here! Get 
Get up! Look out on the right! We got more wolves on the left! Fuera! Get out of here! Angel. Ye away for it. Oh. I don't think so. Jesus. You still with us, Marston? Just, Just run over it. Mm -hmm. You're gonna be okay. We have some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. I think what I don't like really is, is being so how used much? to riding horses. None I don't like how it right sticks now. you so much to the other people in single player. Like, I'm pressing nothing at the moment, and it's riding, and I just want to be in control. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're going to need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving? Damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Nah, you can do better than that. It's just during the missions? One yeah, I know, but it, I, I don't like it, I'll be honest. Yeah, no worries, Talion. Have a good one, buddy. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. Damn, but anyway, when will I be enough, Dutch? John Marston. Come on. Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get no. some help here? Just let him die. He'll be fine. We get some help. We need some help here. Come on, help Come on everybody. Here Come on, a little bit of, you know. Right, here we go. Act like here you care, go. everyone, please. Be careful, idiotas. It's his leg. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. If you and Dutch talk about how we're gonna get out of this, move like you got a purpose. Come on. With Herr Strauss, when the weather breaks, I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East <clears throat> into all that, that civilization. I know. Ugh. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss, let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Moggy. Ugh. Imagine going near civilization. Ugh. Oh, chat. I empathize hard with Arthur Morgan. Look, people, you want to go west towards We've people? We've been running for weeks. I know you have. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town uh -huh. while we the thaw. The thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. Hey, that kind of rhymes, aren't the more in your poet. Welcome to my sister show, where I sing like a cat. What Thank you very much, Daddy. 47 months of insanity. We got hours on it. Thank you very much for 47. Welcome to Master ah. Show, where I sing like a cat. B-O-L-P. Boop! Why did it not say boop, Lex? Thank you very much for seven months streak. Lex, thank you, thank you very much. Very, very much. A tier three as well. A tier three. Um, we must be close to hitting the 100 partner points that we need for April already, chat. Thank you ever so much for that. But then Unlock the that our tracks, uh, so nicer, kind of split from May onwards. Uh, Daddy, what I, was, what I was saying, thank you very much for 40, was it 47 months? 47 months, Daddy. It's too many months, isn't it? Let's be honest. For now. I'll just steal that from him. I'll just take that away. Mm -hmm. We're safe. Stay strong, Jose. I'm just like, yeah, I just want to steal everything. What about you, Arthur? You doubt me too? Never. Good. I mean a little bit. Because you know me, son. I'm just getting started. Once we get some money, well, they they better send some good men after us because they ain't never gonna find us. Oh, oh Obi Dyer would get you. Yeah. Money. Of course, Dutch. Thank you, son. For your strength. It means a lot to me. Well, all right, Dutch. You want you wanna give me a compliment or reach around at the same time? God damn, Dutch. All right, let's open this damn door. Who's your goddamn snow? Oh, hey, you know there's a giant letter B in this building? God damn it, Dutch. You can't leave your bees in the barn. I'll right, just go see who's this prick. Yeah, let's go. 
Hey, okay there, Jose. What's this door open to? Boys, because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lamb, and you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen Thank so you. many long faces. Shut up, Micah. That's it. I guess, I guess folks miss them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> <laughs> a party. <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como Driscoll. Let's go. Yeah, take I that damn you cock out your mouth there, it's Arthur. Here for us. I doubt that. No, nope, you're just doubting me. <gasps> I would never doubt you, Dutch. You You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. Terrible weapon Today, discipline. We're talking about trains and detonators here. Colm always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? Now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. Uh -huh. I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson. Would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscoll's about. Yeah. God damn it, Dutch. You're riding too bad. Southwest. <laughs> <I'm going laughs> yeah. He said follow the main <laughs> oh, trail <love> southwest. <laughs> They're camped near some lake. Okay. Let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this score of their planet. I'm slowly turning into Barnabas. That's what it is. I'm just a grumpy son of a I'm a doo doo house and pout on the zone. What's that? Tracks. Horses, quite a few of them. As far as I can tell. The only fools out here are us and them. Everybody drink. Yay. It's the new drinking game. Whenever Jay talks in a voice that isn't his own, you take a shot. Listen, I know you don't think much <laughs> of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I, I would be so drunk. Please don't. I don't know what you mean. Now, come on. So every 20 die. seconds, pretty much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This between you and him needs to be put to rest one way or another <laughs> it will be some things i can forgive others i can't forget what he did to hannibal i can't do neither oh he this is not, this is lake Dutch. isabel yes i did uh yeah this is a kind of lake isabel isn't it yeah it is yeah yeah, yeah. that's how this will end Damn right, boss. Yeah, that's like Isabel. Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. Yeah, it's just down here. Well, give me my rifle and I'll shoot him in the face from here. <laughs> hey, Dutch! Let's see some smoke! All doing? right, gentlemen. This is it. Are we goddamn ready? I already got off my hey, horse, Dutch. Dutch. I'm stood here like a popsicle. Can now, we get a move on? Mr. Morgan and I. Yes, yeah, sir. We're gonna head up here a little. Oh, I'll get See, back on my horse. Sense of the layout of the camp. Oopsie, sorry, Dutch. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Give a little kiss. Let's go. These horses are in. Oh, I'll get off my horse now, shall I? Well, I know who looks like the asshole. 
Oh, wait. Welcome on the adventure. Hey, how do I get my... Okay. See, why can't I take my guns off this time? Am I not allowed yet? They fuck around so much with the story stuff in the UI. Hey, Dutch, we have a dog at the top of here. You make me look like a goddamn asshole. I look so fucking dumb, Dutch. Hey, I guess I'd use my binoculars. I look too. Okay, we'll both look. He didn't say anything, but I thought I'd look anyway. Oh, look, a horsey. Hey. Here they are. Well, they got a ladder. Them. Home? I think so. Yeah, that's him. Hey, what's that? That looks like a nipple touch. So we, we, we were worried about the snow nipple touch. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why I've suddenly decided that I'm <laughs> crazy. Hey, with them two uh, flabbergasted. I can liberate. Hang on. I will see you back in town over there, Who's but don't take the to? flowers away. He don't seem very happy. I left my flowers oh. up there. You give me your damn flowers, you small ass bitch. Give me flowers. Go on, get the flowers. Yeah, I'm going to get the flowers. I'm sorry. Should we go get them? No. Colin can wait. <laughs> Oh, I'm so scared. Let's get the flowers. Get them. Get the flowers. Mm -hmm. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. Come on, let's get down. It's all about the role play. Well, I am role playing. I'm role playing Arthur Morgan. Hey, but Dutch, what if we just got him some flowers? You think about that, Dutch? Don't to grab that rifle from your horse. Okay, so you're just a hundred percent out on my flowers idea. Okay. Yeah. Hey, hey, gang, gang, he said no to the flowers. Up there. <laughs> sure thing. I may have gone slightly mad, chat. Good. Come on, Get my go. damn long arm. Remember, Jay, don't kill anyone. Well, I don't remember to agree to that. Down as Bill and Micah. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including Calm, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now, come on. Okay, but Dutch, I don't feel like we've discussed this flower idea. Look, I, while we're on this cliff, okay, what if we got him some petunias and, uh... Oh, you want me to walk? Okay, Dutch. Okay, I'll leave the flowers alone. Why is Dutch so far up my taint? Hey. Yeah, goddamn bro. You want to sniff it, Dutch? I'm gonna get out of here. Mass murdering innocent people. Baddies we can shoot. Mm. It's steep here. Careful. It's trying to stay warm. Snuzzle my taint, Dutch. Snuzzle it. You lost your goddamn mind. See, that's more John Marston. He's Marston's like breathier and huskier. I like it. Please do no such thing to my taint. You got a fucking prude in chat. All right. It's a wild hey, west donkey. I take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running. Hush. Let's just get down there first. What if I shot them all from here? Down through these trees, quick. Hey, anybody see Liam? I think he went hunting with the others. Son of a bitch is meant to be on guard duty. No, surely you won, ghouls. Just a uh, just Leroy Jenkins it. Stay low. Come on, follow me. Yeah, the UI in this really isn't that good. See, they mean use the mouse, but it made it look like they were saying use the mouse wheel. Why are we killing them again? Because they're a rival gang. So, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? 
go. You literally said if I want to take the lead, go. Alright, boys. Kill these sons of bitches. Kill every last one of these bastards. I shot his hat off, chat. Damn flank, you son of a bitch. I think that's the other reason I like fucking chaos playthroughs in this game is because the gunplay in this is so much fun. It's so much fun. See, I'm. No. Ah. Hell you. Really, Arthur? Come on. Have you got shins? I'm supposed to tell Dutch I want to take the lead. Seems like an extra, an extra unnecessary step. I'll be honest. Heads up, boys! We got more coming in from the. Front. I'm busy looting, Dutch. Son of a bitch. Honestly, I'd forgotten about it, ghouls. I'll be honest. Look at how many crosses I've got to loot. Alright, Dutch, I need like 20 to 30 minutes. To be honest, genuinely, learning how to shoot without a sight makes you such a better shot in this game. Because you just get so used to like where the center of the screen is roughly. But if I remember rightly right, like it said, you have to eventually get the skill to decide how many markers you put on the enemy you're shooting at because i think at the start of the game it just does it for as long as you're aimed over them no it's always been my experience it just started tagging up as soon as you're on them rather than being able to pick like one shot at a time so many dead bodies chat You can manually put them on later. Yeah, that's what I thought. My God, mummy, have you even played this game? You don't even like this game, do you? Fake fan. Yeah, I went there. I went there. I went there. All right, four more bodies out the front. 
There should be an option if Dutch starts giving you shit to just say, look, I'm busy desecrating the dead. Okay. I also like that looting corpses doesn't affect your honor. You told me to be nice. Weird. It's weird, mummy. I don't like it. Now I'm not going to be so confused. We don't have time to mess around. I look like I'm sitting here with my dick in my hand, Dutch. Good work, boys. Now, let's tear this place apart. Bill, you go search that wagon there. Hey, Bert. Right. Ah, search Jesus Christ. Arthur, you take that building to the left. Now I'm busy. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Oh, is, that, is there another body there? It's hard to tell eventually whether the exes are full or not. I think there is an extra body in there. Well then, Spikey, you win this. Yeah, yeah a lot of bodies chat but i know that money is valuable once we get to the camp so we can upgrade everything hallelujah can't tell there's one on the edge here oh is he there he is flying broom with like a random fact okay the wild west was so called because it's the first time anybody had anal yeah hmm Ding dong merrily on high. Ooh, yeah. What? Yeah, it's true. It's true, girls. Yeah. Ancient Greece would like a word? Well, they'd be wrong. It's a, it's a fact. You know? Yeah. It's a fact. Redeem a random fact. You don't think I just make them up, do you, chat? God. Yeah, it's also the same reason Buckaroo was invented at the same time. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Haven't got Scooter's theme on a soundboard yet? Oh yeah, I have. Absolutely. Welcome to my show, mm. where I sing like a cat. And Red, thank you very much for two months of... Prime bullshit. <gasps> you haven't heard the Scooter Brown theme tune yet, ghouls? I'm so disappointed in you. Beans. Beans. Ah! And away we go. Old. Right, I think we got pretty much everything in here. Yeah, I just realized I read it as Andorath, and it's, um, it's Anadreth. I'm sorry, Anadreth. good. How used to some eye? Looks fine. Smells good. Come on. I do like my dynamite. I think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. <laughs> This is something about the train they was going to rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Well, Leviticus oh, Cornwall. Let's keep moving. Oh, wait, Jack got some of them boomsticks. Right, what if I revoiced Howdy Arthur boys. Morgan as Scooter Brown? I think that's DLC work, that we can all get behind. Not bad for some starving down and outs. They can pummel us hard as they like, but we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Outlaws for life, fellas. Wait until we have John, Mac, Charles, and Sean back riding with us, and I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get combed, but this head will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed, we will. I am you already know, enjoying this more than the last time I tried. Oh, of 
course he will, just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. You're rambling, Dodge. Who did with the what's it on the where who? All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. Here you go. Cotton Holio. Si. Oh, I was hoping for a wide shot. Oh, that's not too bad. Have for a wide shot. There we go. Hey, welcome, welcome on the adventure. adventure. And of the third. Thank you so much for that hey, follow. Welcome on in. That fella? Wasn't he at the camp we call him? Leave him to me. All right. We're heading back. Just bring him back alive. He could be useful. Okay. Come on, yeah. let's go. Let's get it. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just playing around with the. <laughs> hey, you remember me? Kindly let you go. Hey, how well can you breathe underwater? Don't hurt me. Come on, let's see you go down the hill. I want you to be like a rubbish kite. Come on, boy. Hey, yo, come on, let's go first. I gotta wash you off before I present you to Dutch. There you go. Come on, boy. Come on, squirm for it. You wanna come in here with me? The water's nice and fresh. <laughs> What's wrong with me, chat? I probably shouldn't because I'll probably end up drowning him and then that's it. Remember, don't kill trains. Thank you, yes. Isn't this an honor playthrough? I haven't done anything to him yet. This is just let it go, come on. He's he's close, chat. Let's get him let's get him up. Alright, go. You got me mixed up with someone else. I mean that come on, we only dragged him through the snow. That's that's basically um making please, sweet love please you don't need to do this i do i'm afraid i do son now i'm gonna put you near my horse's asshole i don't want you to please, be getting up no. to anything weird okay Oop, you go what's your name boy i don't know you don't know your name it's kieran kieran what duffy kieran duffy well i ain't gonna lie um, to you um, um, um. This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No, please. Yeah, that's good practice. Don't do it again. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da 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 -da. Come on. Please. Don't make me. Hey, you. You better shut your mouth, you little shit, or I will shut it for you. Maybe I should bring a crim to to ranch. I can't I do three die, characters mister. in a week. Just let me go, please. Please, I'll do anything. Are you trying to test me? Is anything? I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay. Okay. That's two bones right there. Tell me, have you uh, heard uh, of a story called Broke Back Mountain? 
we've got the mountain i'm just saying <laughs> all right let's hit you up here we are you sack of shit let's introduce you to the boys Yep. Don't hurt me, please. Oh, don't worry. They're real nice. Don't try to understand them. Just rope them in and brand them. Keep them something rolling uh, or I. Oh, shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got them. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. <sighs> You want me to make him talk? Oh, no. Now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting. Save fellas as need saving. And feed them as need feeding. We are going to find out what you need. <laughs> I can't believe it. An O'Driscoll in my camp. No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister. I, I hate that fella. Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. It's such a good game. Are you going to come and talk to me? Jay, I'm part of a Frostpunk roleplay Discord. Holy shit, that sounds cool. What do you, what do, you do? Log in? Really early in the morning? Discord for 12 hours and then trudge through the snow? And then fall asleep under the toll of the bell and the heat of the furnace? Would you be willing to do a one-year anniversary shout-out? In the voice of the city for some subs, sure. Why not? Do you have the name? Does it? Do you have a name? Does your city have a name? And I have cameo is not a thing, sales. That's why there's no link for it yet. Frostantinople? Oh my god, that's amazing. A little bit of reverb, maybe. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Frostantinople! One year of work has passed. Our furnace burns strong. And the city must survive. Enjoy this one day off. Because tomorrow, the work continues. A new law has passed. There you go. How's that? I'll do it for you. Constantine and Frostantinople. It's so weird being up here. I'm like, I was just here yesterday in roleplay. In their tongue, he's Dovacin. Why are you like this? Oh, I prematurely muted. Why are you like this? Why are you like this, chap? <coughs> oh, this dude. To death up here, Mr. Morgan. We're okay. Welcome to my show. Where I Thank you, Ender. Like that was very kind of you. Food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? Let me know if you need a good clip of it or anything. In the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea. A lot of sex. 50 chat. days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. Earth the morning! We'll survive. We always have. 
If needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. My pleasure, Edna. My absolute Lenny pleasure. Bill hunting and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough nothing. of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something neat out there. Assorted salted off. Mm. Starving. I bet that tastes throat. awful. Let's go. You can't go on. Look at your hand. No. You stay here right. listening to you two. Look at this game in those hills. I'll find it, and you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. Are you excited about Frostpunk 2, Ender? You gonna play the beta? Because that's this month, right? Beta's out this month. Uh, release in July? At some point? Here, you take this. I can't use it and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Yeah, goddamn bow. Gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. Come on. I don't know this way. Goddamn bow arrow. Let's go. Horse bonding increased. Hold the. Uh, the. How are you holding up, Charles? I'm okay. <gasps> I did it, chat. I did it. Stupid mistake. Horse bondage improved. It'll be fine in a day or two. Good job. I just can't pull a bow right now. Uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. I played it on stream once, Mumbly. It's a great game. I was I was all right at it. Ish. It's very pretty though. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. Here, okay, boy. I wanna be super bonded to my horse. We'll head up this way. Find some higher ground. You went. Use the bow. That's amazing. I love the bow and arrow, though. That ride north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm, going out for John. That thing with the O'Driscolls. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that. Just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. Well, Javier told me a bit. But you <laughs> sure weren't good. Uh, I am canoe, yep. Yeah. Always many pats. You just hold G down. All the pats for my best horse. God damn Arthur Morgan. ABP, always be Patton. More liquid chat. Gotta get a liter done by the end of the day. Yeah, good boy. See some of the ground uncovered here. Let's try this way. Keep your eyes peeled for movement. I'm drinking and riding. Leave me alone, have you? <laughs> the wind <clears throat> died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. You're so creepy, Arius. Hi there. Hello. <sighs> hey, stop here a second. I see something. Seven days beta in April. As in the beta is in seven days or they get access for a week. <clears throat> There's deer been here. Mm. Recently. How can you tell? Got you worse, got you. How can you not? Yeah, Arthur, Let's you dumbass. You're gonna need the bow. Don't leave it on your horse. Gun will scare everything yeah, away. yeah. Keep that. Move quietly. 
slowly and slowly. I always forget, is there arrow drop off in this game or not? Like, do you put the reticule or the reticle on the deer? I think so. <clears throat> Maybe not. Focus. I'll get an eagle eye. It's easier in the snow, but once you get your eye in, you'll be able to track nearly as well in grass and woods. Or oh, I just get a scooter brown. He knows everything. Oh, it is such a good game, though. Like, I want to get to a point as well where I'm... Uh, just I can go off and do the hunt, hunt the big animals and the legendary bears and stuff. That's right, I got Scooter Brown. I know what I'm doing. Hey, there's one. I see it. Hey, I don't want my damn arrow. I just pulled it out by accident, okay? God damn it, Javier. Got it. Well done. I think that's all we can carry. Noise! Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. Okay. You show your hands, okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Okay, I'll go grab the other one. I got him. And Leoop. Because am I, am I right in thinking that, yeah, there's like some legendary bears and stuff that you can like do all this tracking and hunt them down and get like limited edition pelts and outfits and stuff. Because like, I do like the hunting part of this, I must admit. Come on. Is it? Is there much repetition to it, though? Like, once you've hunted the legendary bear, right? That's that's it, right? Oh, yeah. And, uh, sorry, baseball's question as well. Does it have dragons? That's, I would like to know Not that. Bad, boy. Thank you. Let's go, boy. All right. Ready to head back when you are. Come on, then. Let's head back. Yep. Yeah. All right, we dropped off a Pearson. Nice do the thing in the bubble. Enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. There we go. You found him. <laughs> no dragons. Yeah, okay There's at least one ball. anaconda. Yeah, it's easier <laughs> when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure, there he is. One giant See, anaconda. Looking a couple of days back. Well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Don't say that. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. If you, <laughs> I was about to make a really bad joke about the Donners. Still have a big price on our heads. 
Has it been long enough since the Donna Donna thing in the mountains that we can make jokes? It's like it's a couple of it's like a hundred years, aren't we? All right? We're all right now. One hundred and fifty years or something. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater. I was gonna say I tried to work in a joke. To grab the essentials and go. If you, and if you put the Donners, if you put the Donners in a, in a sandwich, one. is it a party We've sub? Been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. <sighs> uh, we ain't feeding Neil Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful piercing. Last year, too soon. To yeah, that's what I thought. The girl, she has a wild look in her eye. <sighs> of course. She lost her husband, her home. Everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. My head just remembered a party sub, and then I was like, I bet I can work a Donna party joke in there somewhere. <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. Donna kebab. What is it with your Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? <laughs> I suppose. Yeah, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess <laughs> That's the perfect joke, dancing way. nerd. Nah, That's the perfect joke. I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been <gasps> scrapping over scores with them for um, years. Bear. 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 Nasty son. Bear. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Let's see if we can find another way around. Uh, what if I just shot it, though? You must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep. Well, he's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. Shut up, loser. That's a bad We got it! Holy shit, that bear takes a pasting. Oh my god, how strong is that bear? I don't even know if you can actually kill that bear, to be fair. Oh yeah, sorry, it's not an open world RPG yet. <laughs> Sorry, it's not an open world RPG yet. I forget. I'm not loud. Hey, Arthur, you awake back there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I was just dreaming Thank about bears. Thank you. We ain't ever talked that much, you and me. How long you been with us now? Five, yeah, Jesus, months? Charles, get over it already. Something like that. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this? Blackwater mess. Being up here. Ah, uh, sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No, no, not at all. I just, I know you could run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still <laughs> wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. <laughs> Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh, 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy, 
20 years? Yeah. <laughs> he taught me to read. John, too. He taught me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. That saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. Lila Morgan. How's that new horse? He's all right. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I could have been patting it all the way home, Jack. What an amateur. happened to the count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. <laughs> I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the count once. It bucked me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody <laughs> but him. Nice, boy. Are any of them a big shire I'm horse? That's all I need. Brought some food back, boys. Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. I will uh, say. Thank you for showing me how. Okay, so horse cargo is different. Robert. Cool. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. Um. I will say, I like the only thing that I don't. I haven't seen any roleplay server have is the way the weapons that look stored on the horse. Um, you don't get like. And the way you take it out of the horse is really nice in, um, in the single player version. Also, Ghouls, can I come and run law on your new server? Just, or just training deputies? Just drop it down in here. I was I was screaming today on chat. There's like surprise. six deputies all camp, sat on the porch and I'm like, what the, the fuck kitchen. are we doing? Hey, to greet an old friend. I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid you. Why, he loves me really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well. See you gents later. See you hey, guys. Hey, Just fine. Charles is a wonder. <laughs> Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? There's Baby moonshine. Rubs, it's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you saying it does. Yeah, oh. Seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. I'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Do I get to skin you? <coughs> You always one with the jokes, aren't oh my. you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skin that one, you, you dumped on the floor there. Chat, I have a question. And I have a nutrition question. Can anyone in chat answer me this? What has fewer carbs? Rice or pasta? On your marks, get set, go. Huh. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town if you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Do but like the gentleman. Gonna get off this mountain alive. Yeah, well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Noodles, Thanks. you get the fuck Arthur out. Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. <laughs> yeah. Well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Need it. It's been a tough few days. I didn't think that was much in it. Yeah, <coughs> sounds about right. A few days later. Like we're basically talking like it's basmati bad, rice or, or standard uh, white pasta. Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You still here then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. Why, Rice? Come? Of course I do, but look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. 
Hello, Abigail. Butch. Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. Or what's left of me. What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway men. Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah, come on. What do you want from me, Hosea? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. Money, money, money. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? You know, he's a big railway magnet. Sugar dealer, oil man. Sugar well, dealer. For him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch. Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob. Yay. Wobbly. Everyone ready? Da -da -da -da. Right, let's head out. It's time to be an outlaw. Look, now I can pet my horsey. Okay, gentlemen, listen up, all of you. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the O'Driscoll, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're going to pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep a lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Oh, Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You and me, Morgan. Great. Have you got a problem with that? Not yes. You keep your head for Massive once. problem. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough. After Bill blows the tracks, we're going to need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep. Crystal. Yes, boss. Good. Now, come on. Let's ride. Don't steal trains, but blowing up trains is okay. Yes, and robbing from the train. Yes. See, Gulls, Gulls is helping out chat, justifying my actions here. Stay calm. Keep your eyes so short. Pretty. That goes for all of you. No mistakes. Not again. So we do this, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back, and that's the end of it money's safe. You'll just have to trust me. And if the O'Driscolls are right, there'll be a stack of railroad bonds on this train. Good money once we work out how to cash them. Now everyone, shut up! 
and get your mind on the job at hand. Come on. There's the water tower. Hold up He's here. so on pretty. Bridge. Words, did you wait for me to finish my two liters and then and then redeem and make me drink? I'm gonna have to take the I'll have to take the lid off. Get a hold of that horse, Morgan. Oh, take it easy there. Okay, boy. All right, calm down. Jesus. Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. There you go. I did done do a drink. Ah. Yeah, all right. I'll go get my gun. I'm going to go. Ghouls would like a random fact. Okay. Uh, the rifle. What are you waiting for? Hey, I'm giving out some goddamn <laughs> facts. You shut your dirty mouth, Dutch. Hmm. This is a good spot. The uh, the rifle is so cool because the first time it was created, and for providing all the, explosives. the creator of the rifle <laughs> got uh, very aroused. See, look, I can't strafe right without letting go of W. Which is not a problem in Red Dead Online. It's weird. Uh, yes, sorry. The rifle is so cool because the first time it was created, the man who made the rifle was so aroused, he stripped himself fully naked. And the person peering in through the window got an eyeful. And therefore, the weapon became known as the rifle. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Wow, I know, right? All that learning. Yeah. All that learning. Yeah. Ooh. Uh, in the Frostbite RP, we basically flesh out the lives of the NPC people in the game. Nice. A game master dictates the story in writing, and we vote on city choices like building tech and laws. That's really cool, Ender. I love that. What a great way to take um, some inspiration and turn it into something else. That's really cool. That's really cool. Um, little known fact. I voice all of the little NPCs. If you zoom down into the city, you'll hear some of the city folk um, chatting away. Uh, that's also all me as well. My spine just cringed so hard. Why? What's wrong? What's, what's wrong? How you getting on? Yeah. I'm okay. Why are we bringing sure. a lit lantern over here? Horse. Can I help a little? It's just a fact, gang. All I right. don't make it up, okay? Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Oh, okay, oh, sure. Oh, dear. Just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. A great noise. Okay, this is good. Everybody, bow me. Right. That should do it. You head back up to the others. I guess ah, I'm it's fine, baseball. We we got plenty of cowboys. Come on, I think it's your ass up here. Or well, just a little mistake. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Wow, well, now are you gonna park my okay? horse anywhere? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be here any minute now. Look at me. They'd never know who I am. Gentlemen, it's time. Good luck, all of you. You all know what to do. Here we go. Shit, no, what? God! Oh, you have got to be kidding. 
kidding me? Where did you find that moron? You said it was fine. So it's my fault. Come on! You're pathetic. You know that? Ah, uh, oh, damn! Let's go! Here we go! Here we go! <laughs> oh no! I have become the character. Yeah, you're okay. Now let's go slow this thing down. Where's Javier? He fell. The others will get him. Come on, we need to stop this train. Hold on. Supposed to tap it or pop? Oh, it's so annoying. There you go. You know how to take a punch. Oh my God! It's a Lincoln. Shit! Don't back in cover, you dopey ass. Shit! Yeah, straight through the ear hole. All these bastards must be guarding something. We need the car. How did that miss? Yep, keep pushing on. Shoot so many people's Good. hats off, chap. Damn, he's got an arm. Who is this guy? Doing good, kid. Where the hell are you? I don't know. Oh, shit. They're coming out of that last car. Oh, they're on the burner boo. Bodies. I can see so now many bodies. Driscoll's brought so many boys up here for this. Marker, get over here. Yeah, I'm, I fell over a little bit. It's fine. <laughs> you two all right? Yes. Let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. <gasps> ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Oh, no. Wake them up a little. Enough. I got a little, let's see, I want to fully restore you. I need something for my health. 
then what's the difference it's something like provisions do the cause right and tonics do the bit around the outside question mark Dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. That feels about right, I think. Here's go do big bang boom. Now, don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Now light the fuse. Okay. Here we go. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. All right, come on. Just walk on out here. Okay, but what if I shot them a little bit? <laughs> kill you. My... We just want to rob your boss. Get on up there. Search that train. Yeah, I'm going Dutch. Oh my god, stop making me look silly in front of the other boys. What? Why can't I just walk? Jesus Christ. Look at this place. It's like a palace. Well, now I've seen everything. I'm very muddy, Chad. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. I will inspect the letter. You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will you? Parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur Dear Mr. Cornwall, yeah, we are yet to receive payment of $2,000. The initial phase train. of exploration at the Wapiti Indian okay. Reservation, Amberino, as agreed in the contract between Cornwall Kerosene and Tar and the Leland Oil Development Company dated November 8th, 9th, 1898. On receipt of the funds, we will proceed with phases two and three of the project to present you with a detailed report of the findings within the month. Yours respectfully, James Critchley. For Leland. For the Lelands. Ah. Ah. There. See? That's how it's done. Is it? Are you sure about that? Just a pile of papers. Meow. Meow. Now the outlaws strong. make fun of me. Here. Make yourself useful. At least we all know you can read. <sighs> Give me those. Yeah, I think, like, it's weird. The game takes a lot of control of your, like, look how slowly I'm walking right now, which is not the normal walking pace when you're out and about. It just feels a little weird. A lot of sugar. Some fancy new boat he's ordered from Europe. I'm not robbing another boat as long as I live. Hello, here. Gonna have a look. Ooh. Hello. This looks like some. Have you checked all the drawers and cabinets? Yoink. Think I got him. Nice. Well, thank God. Come on. Well, he's got a nice desk. Oh. Hang on. Ooh, cigarettes. Yoink. Okay. All right, chat. Before we carry on, I'm going to go do a quick uh, wee wee in the toilet place. I will uh, BRBB. Okay. Hang on. I love this time of night. There's an almost reverent silence that accompanies the peak of darkness. When you almost believe the dawn will never break. The cradle of eternity. The timelessness of lovers. The most beautiful of fantasies. Why does that music fit so much? <laughs> oh, holy fuck, that fitted so well. Okay. Um. Okay. Okay. Okay, here we go, here we go. Is this gonna be a quadruple stack? Oh! Okay, everyone in the stack is dead. <laughs> Do you like would you like a sweet? Oh, I'd love a sweet. You'd like a sweet? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. You should probably try one of these. They're the best sweets in the world. What is this yellow one? Oh, it's uh sunshine and puppies. 
Why no, it's like, it? you know, it's the sense of happiness and joy in it. Oh, you'll love it. Does it make it from squeezing real puppies? Do they squeeze them real hard or is it like a hug? Uh, it's a hug. Puppy hug. Okay. Puppy hug, and they cook oh, it with the warmth. Oh, no, I dropped it on the floor. Oh, no. Well, it's all right. It's just there. God damn it. I can see it. It's <laughs> right there. And then it goes. Fine. That's really nice. Thank you, Heath. What? It's lovely. Right, well, I should probably try an orange one. It's really oh. nice. It's like peach, right? Oh, good. I'm so glad. I am Lucius Alabaster of Alabaster's Analeptics, abating and laying and alleviating all antagonistic and aggravating ailments. Uh, I have no idea. Was he speaking French? Uh, English. Would you prefer it in French? I could give it to you in French. Is that easier? Go on then. Je m'appelle Lucius Alabaster of Alabaster's en On veut t'appeler pour vous chez les fêtes à la bande de l'Uperc. Je veux te t'en mettre à Saint-Dersant à Rib. He said the same thing. You ever think bleaching your anus should be called changing your ringtone? <laughs> 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 All right. I have returned. I'm ready once more. Oh, look at this. Are Wait. You done in there? No, goddamn it, Butch. There was an inspect card somewhere. Yeah. Oh, that's a letter. Hi, Amelia. Guten Morgen. This along now? Oh, I swear to God. Dutch. I swear to God. Dear Leviticus, thank you for your telegram and for your continued interest in the Jameson Mining Company. However. Wait. Right. Sorry, Chang. Just, just, uh, just give me a minute, would you? Hey! Oh, damn it! <laughs> what did you find? These bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell Chuck. these pretty easily. Furious well, now. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah. Get it out of here. What about them? Was well, I about to shoot him? No, vaguely threaten. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. Very aggressive ride. Okay. Get on the train, quick. Oh, yeah. I can't remember if I. Ideas, I kill all three. So behave. I don't. I think I killed them all last time. Move. We won't tell a soul. I swear. <gasps> no. Oopsie. It'll keep the others in line. It's. Oh, that's all right. Mm -hmm. I hear so much as a footstep from this car. Ooh. Go ahead and drive all your friends out here. Whoops. Just a little. I don't understand how that happened because I'm pretty sure I didn't pull. I didn't click the left trigger. Uh, am I going to loot every single one of these bodies, chat? I'm kind of tempted to do a max loot run. Yeah. Never talk back to Jay. Good to know. Yeah, just get on the train. All right. I was going to take them to Disneyland Paris, but now, now he's just going to be dead in the dirt. Yeah. Lulu, I've had an oopsie again. <laughs> it's all right, chat. I've got a plan. Evil playthrough, maybe? No, I can't do an evil playthrough. It costs too much money to do an evil playthrough. It's a hell of a shot, though, chat. I'll take that as a shot. I want to go to Disneyland Paris. Me too. I want to go on a holiday. Yeah. Oh, gold pocket watch. Nice, nice. You could rob people. Money problem solved. That's a fair point. 
Um, what I am going to do, though, because um, of the sort of messed up I am, is... Do, 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 do. Okay, there we go. Oh! Oh, I can't even get in. I wanted to put the corpse of uh, their friend in there with them. Uh, game would let me. It's no fun at all. Just a little oopsie to keep the others in line. Yes, just a, just a small, small disciplinary oopsie. Yeah. <gasps> Do you know what? They had something in Vegas that might be one of the best attractions I have ever been to. And it's gone now. But I remember it just being unbelievable. It was just in a hotel. Did anyone else get to go on the Star Trek experience? Which I think was in the Hilton, I want to say. Could be wrong. But I think it was the Hilton. And I'm also, and I'm pretty sure it's not a thing anymore. Like there was a little Star Trek museum and then a ride essentially. And it was phenomenal. If you were a Trekkie, it was it was just the most amazing thing you could possibly imagine. It was so good, and it makes me wish that like Universal or Disney would add something Star Trek to their parks because there's so much scope for it. Okay, you want me to tell you what it was? Because it was so good. I'll tell you what it was. Enter the train. Start the train. And also, it was just so well done as well. I couldn't quite figure out how they did it. Choo -choo. Well done, Arthur Morgan. Good work. Was it Space Hookers? No. Space Hookers and Blow. We're probably about to get a cutscene, but after that, I'll um, I'll tell you about the Star Trek experience. Oh my god, chat! I'm hungry. I'm so hungry today. Oh, for Lord's sake, put that book away and go help. Oh, Mary Beth. So we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed a Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well then, let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. Get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me? With the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey.
Okay, so. The Star Trek experience. Idiot. Um, so, it was like a little Star Trek museum thing, right? At the start. And you went through the museum and you walked around. And then... No, I need to hit it so that the wheel falls off. Gotta keep us moving, but calm. Ah, aren't the Morgan? Okay, let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. Yeah, I need to tell a Star Trek story right, first, Charles, though. You and me hold the thing up I wonder how long they'll wait. Back on, you still strong enough to hold up a wagon? How long do we think they'll hold Just it, Chuck? Well, say less. <laughs> so, you go into this little room, right? Um, probably about the size of, like, I don't know, four elevators? Like, you know, that kind of size room. Um... And they're like, oh, okay, we'll take you through into the next area. So the door's shut behind you. There's closed doors in front of you. But then all the lights go out. And they're, you know, typical American theme park thing. They're like, oh, all the lights go out. Um, and there's a, you know, a roof above you as well. And they go, all the lights go out. And then a teleporter pad circle appears under each person in the room. Um... And then I can't remember exactly what happened, but there's some, like, you know, flashy lights and magic stuff happens. And then when the lights come back on again, you're no longer in this elevator room. You are basically in, like, one of the cargo rooms of the Enterprise. And it's just, there's just Star Trek shit everywhere, right? The room is now, like, ten times the size, Right? And there's like, you're in like a shuttle bay access corridor type thing. And then they're like, we don't know what's happened. And then Star Trek personnel appear or, you know, Federation personnel appear. And they're like, follow us now. And there's like, whoop, whoop, all the red alert stuff. And you get in a turbo elevator. <laughs> and you go up and you walk onto the bridge of the Enterprise and it's fully manned like there's someone at ops tactical at the helm there's like somebody sat in the number two spot in the chairs in front um and then basically they play out this story which Enterprise I think it was like TNG style Enterprise um and they're all in the middle of a fight and like I, I vaguely remember like on screen like the Klingons are attacking and the ship sort of shakes a little bit and they're like basically you've you've accidentally come here um in a quantum event we need to get you home right um and then I think Commander Riker appears on the screen to tell you what's going on and he's like in another ship in this fight or something and then they usher you all off the bridge into the turbo elevator you go down you go into a shuttle bay and you get into an inter, you know, a Federation shuttle, and it's a simulator, and then they fly you out of the Enterprise. I guess they're assuming that you're on the Enterprise, and you fly through this battle that's going on, and essentially you teleport back through time, and you crash land back into the Hilton. And that's it. That's, that's the experience. But, like, to walk out onto the bridge with people actually fully role-playing it all out was really cool really really cool all right sorry guys here we are they waited a long time i'll just say that much nearly there Okay, okay, here we go. Okay, we need to get you on Rise of the Resistance. Uh, please don't tell me anything about it. Please don't tell me anything about it, but yeah. Uh, yes, I am biting a silicon coaster. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not One of my favorite things what from happened? the new films. Well, get in. Was when they come across the lake. 
pam pam pararam pam pararam pam pararam pam 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 pararam 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 dum it's a resistance they're all waiting on us arthur yeah yeah all right jesus not too far now stay on this trail we'll follow the river pam pam pararam pam 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 Bum, 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 so, bum, bum, ba-da-dum, yes. ba-da-dum, ba-da-da-dum, bum. So right, Spice is right. so good. It's such a this great moment. The and they're all so we low across the lake. Oh. They lost it all. Stolen clean That's away one hell of a pilot. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well... Maybe it's not. So, Chad, just so you know, this area we're riding through now is the same area where Scooter was gold panning this morning, and look how different it looks. How do you rob Mainly the depth of the foliage. We don't. In spite of that, just talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our block-headed driver here. Well, rude. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget. This here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. Yeah. Well, now after the stream, I know what I'm going to so, have to listen to. What happened to your track? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did, but... When we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. John Williams forever. Later, so good. My mother, took us I somewhere. do like Michael Giacchino though. He's again. also really good. Did some we of the more... Uh, he did Rogue One actually, Michael Giacchino. I think. Hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston. Uh, Michael Giacchino did, Wait, um... I don't understand. Star Trek Into What's Darkness. What's between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. And there's a bit of music in Star Trek Into Darkness. Are we still heading the right way? That depends. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin Where forests Scotty? as we plan? Is no. opening the vent and they're, to, they're traveling through space. On our Khan and um, down the Shatner. <laughs> Khan yes, and Kirk. I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls. Our kind of place. The Driscolls? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait. What's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? <laughs> it's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed. Oh, he did him, No Way Home? Nice. We kept telling him that fairy job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. Oh, look, that's where Scooter was gold like panning Dutch today. To lose his head like that. Things go wrong But it's sometimes. all this bit here, right? It's so die. much lusher than in the um, it is. Always has been. In online. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long There's time. just more trees. And we're still here, so what's the problem now? Well, I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. Na -na -na. And Doctor Strange. Yeah, I like I like Giacchino. When I found out working on there anyway. Just so much talking in this game. Got that it. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah. You can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. Okay, you'll be quiet now. Yeah, like I didn't realize the like the job Giacchino did with Rogue One. I didn't realize that, like he was called in with something like two weeks notice because the original composer slash arranger slash conductor had to leave, was fired. Not sure, but I, all I know is that Giacchino was thrown in really late into Rogue One and just kind of gone, "Help, please." 
make this not shit. Easy now. Handy baby yeah. doom. Oh, hello, kitty cat. Doom, baby doom. Baby doom. See, I almost don't recognize this, and I should know this area like the back of my hand. Okay, yeah, there's Valentine up that way. There you are, brother. Head in there. Follow the track for a bit. Thanks. Hey, slow up. I'm oh, no wait. Welcome on the adventure. Well, come on, then. Get on in. Hello. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. Any trouble getting in here, Javier? Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Yes, it is. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. We can get downtown into Valama time. Doom, 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 doom. I wonder if there's a video of, um... Sweet home. Of the Star Trek experience at the Hilton. You weren't wrong, Jose. This place Here we is are. perfect. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now, it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Hosea. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck. East of the Grizzlies and out of money. And a, a long way from our dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother. But we are safe. We make a bit of money here. Then we move again. Head out around them. Be west of Uncle Sam. In a few months, buy some land. I hope so. Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough, but we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson! I've seen shit with more common sense than you. Do it properly. Wow. Chapter two. Horseshoe. Overlook. A couple of weeks later. Dutch and I were 
just wanking each other off. Got off the mountain, rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartland. Ain't been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more, and I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier. Spot of black water and that whole mess. Arthur. They keep messing up my Jose. amazing narration. <laughs> Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm going to read a book. <laughs> As you walked away, I couldn't help but think what a goddamn nerd he was. Here I am with my gun and my knife, and he has his words. Oh, Arthur, my boy. Excuse me, Dutch. Boy. I'm busy thinking. What's Could, going on? You keep it down, Nothing. Dutch. Nothing at all. For the first time in weeks. Nothing. We're free. We're free to plan our own futures once more. I hope so, Dutch. You kept the faith, Arthur. You always kept it. And I ain't losing it now. As Dutch walked away, I couldn't help but remember the image of his pulsating ass all right let's let's see what's around the camp i never really figured out what was going on here you bring him food and he i don't know gets happy about it okay Oh, is the book? Can I donate to the book yet? Yeah. Oh, I can contribute. Okay. Mm, give you. Uh, let's give you an item. Yes. Ding dong. They really need to add like a just a donate all option. Ah, sixty goddamn bucks. There you go. Hey, Dutch, mind your roll. I will give you some money. I would donate sixty dollars and forty-five cents. Keep it coming. Mainly because the there, like the sooner you can get this ledger up and running, the better from vague memory. Ding dong, merrily on high, in heaven the bells are ringing. We're gonna run out of meat here soon if we're not careful. Okay, so you can donate all. Or donate for funds. I don't really know what the difference is. And the game doesn't ever really explain it. Chat, any knowledge? What's the difference between donating and donating for funds? Like, does that go towards stews and upgrades and that just gives me money? I'm guessing. Because he makes stew and shit. But he'll also craft you upgrades. So... I don't know. I think that's what that means. Ding dong merrily on high. There's my red dead experts. I think that's donating it for food. That's you just get money from it. Let's see what happens. Sure. Might as well make some money off it. Okay, it doesn't seem to have done any difference. Just in time, Mr. Morgan. 
I'm not sure. It looked like we. Hmm. Good job, Mr. Morgan. And then we got crafting Very upgrades. Crafting at the moment, Mr. Morgan. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Thanks, Mr. Pearson. Ebba dooba doo. Morning, Arthur. Morning. How are things? Oh, I do want to change my outfit. I don't actually like this outfit. Me too. Uh, trim my hair, yes. Mm. Mm. Oh, I can't do it all at the same time. I want to do it all at the same time so I can tell what it's going Oh, no, there we go. All facial hair. That's terrifying. Mm. I want to cut his hair though. New bits and pieces. Nothing that exciting. Not yet. Okay, change clothing. Outfits. The gun slinger. The summer gun slinger. The winter gun. <gasps> it's Obi! Okay, that's it. Own outfits, custom outfits, gunslinger, outfits on horse. Okay. Okay, I'm going to go with... I just like it because it's close to Obi. I hate the hat, but it's close. You have no outfit suitable for hot or cold weather on your horse. Okay, but how do I, how do I put it on the horse? Oh, wait, I can modify it. Hang on. Ah! I don't know why. This game just confuses the fuck out of me half the time. Okay, that's average temperatures. All right, we put, we put the summer gunslinger on the horse. Okay. It's this. This is what I noticed. Why do you walk so slowly in the camp? Like, come on, let's move like we got a bit of a purpose, please. Just a little bit. Oh, I think the black dots are chores, aren't they? I believe. No running in the camp. You could trick, trick and hurt yourself. Uh, am I supposed to be putting this? Oh my god, over there? Oh, it's so far! <laughs> oh, it's so far, chat! Look how far away this is! <laughs> I don't like doing chores in real life. This is bullshit. Look, I'll talk to you in a minute. All right. I gotta put... You're Arthur, right? No, shh. I got, I got no chores to do. He does move faster doing chores, yeah. And then look, he walks like an old man. Is there no way to speed him up? Yeah, well, leave it there, eh. Yeah. Oh, I can hold shift. But now he looks like he's walking like he needs a poo. Uh, uh, quick, quick, Arthur. Like, they walk so much nicer on audio. It's weird, chap. It's weird. <gasps> quick, make some TikToks, Arthur. This is how you get famous. You just chop wood on TikTok. That's it. That's what I've heard, anyway. Yeah. <sighs> Well, if he poos, it will only take... I'm not saying I my poos only take two minutes. I'm saying two minutes is enough time to have a poo. All right? Well, it's not my... I don't recommend. But you can have a poo in two minutes. That's all I said. Okay. Yeah. That's a called a torpedo. Da, da, da. There we go. Why am I doing the chores, chat? I just like it. Hello, good work, Arthur. I'm such a good boy. Look at me. Let me do all the chores around camp. Okay, then we got my weapon stuff there. Howdy, Howdy doody. And now it's just open, right? Like I can just fuck off and do what I want now. 
Uncle needs to speak to you. Yeah, I remember him. There was a lot in town. Alright, let's go speak to Uncle, because I think that from memory that makes us go into Valentine anyway. Wait, I can do this drawer again? Yeah. Got some provisions there, do you, Arthur? Well, well, well. Captain State the Obvious has arrived at camp. Buy guns! I've already got guns. Pew pew. I can shoot them. Is anybody getting me some? No. I made some sausages. My cat sniffed them and then sat and stared at them. Okay, but now I want sausages, so. I can't believe you did that to me. Pearson! I'm famished! Believe me, you'll be the first to know! Thank God somebody's doing some work around here. Well, thank you there, Mr. Pearson. I'm trying to be a good cowboy. Cowboy Man, that's my name. Steven Cowboy Man! You okay, Lenny? Da, 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 um. Hello, we did rice and pasta to you earlier. Alright, I'm sorry. Feed the horsies. Yeah, are these sausages like undercooked? Oh, I could go and have an egg sandwich after stream. Fuck, oh, I want an egg sandwich. Why did I say that out loud? Holy shit, you can really pump up your dead eye from doing these chores. Arthur. Yes. Da, 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 da. Yeah, a nice simple egg sandwich. A little bit of butter and ketchup. That's all you need. Hey, Arthur. But I'm busy. No, no, I guess I'm not far. Be I was going to say I'm not far behind you, but that sounds weird. That sounds like I'm coming to your bed. Come on, I'm so hungry. Don't mess with me, please. I did it. I did it, chat. Eh, nope. Oh, I'm gracefully putting the bin down. Okay. The picking up ding. Oh, man. I want to play Sekiro now. Why are there so many chores? I know this is probably very dull, but I'm enjoying just the ding. One of these days, we'll actually get the man to help with the laundry. I mean, I'm sorry. Are they too busy, you know, cooking the food, feeding the horses, topping up the water, chopping the wood? This feels like quite a fair distribution of tasks. I'll be honest, I don't really need to see the need for the snide comments. Wow. Maybe one day we'll get the women shooting all the people, huh? God damn it. Their tummies were growling earlier. Y'all ride the hell out of them horses. Yeah, yeah, I'm here to give them hey, shut up. Just finished the Pendragon's Legacy stream. It really did, son. Yeah. It really did go much better than any of us deserved for that rescue to go. 100%. Yeah. One day we'll get the women to move the hay. Hey. Did you get it? No? Okay. Wake up, dumbass. Ow! Oh, oh, oh. Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Well, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Do you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out? Sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses are ready. <sighs> You gonna take the old man into town? You can take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> well, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take mm -hmm. them a robin. You're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on in. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, hey, wait. Valentine. 
very embodiment to civilization. <laughs> you ladies are gonna love it. Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Out through the trees here, then take I remember the first time I ever rode into Valentine. It's just, it's insane. Absolutely insane. Can you take the wagon up to Inspiration Point? Where's that? It is sun, yeah, yeah, this is the single player. I've never finished it. I've only ever got like a maybe a maybe a third into the story and then just yeah. just stopped for no apparent reason really. Lady, bring us a song. Whoa. I love that little mistake because I reckon that was real. And it's not that the UI is different. I think objectively, Red Dead Redemption 2 doesn't have a good UI. I think it's overcomplicated for what it needs to do. Actually. Yeah, I'm oh, going to get it. It's very serious. All right, I'll see what's going on. Lumbago, really? You all right there, friend? Oh, friend, you see? You couldn't help me get my other horse back from over there, could you? Sure, no problem. Thanks. It's the white one over there. Yes, I, I acquainted myself with all two of the horses you were driving. Or easy now, girl. Easy. easy. I'm gonna study this horse and oh, it's a giant shire 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 jap. We like a shire. We got it right here, yo. No, we're high honor. High honor playthrough. We are the most honorable cowboy man. Cowboyman that has ever lived. Here you go. Here. Here you go. You're a gentleman, sir. A gentleman. No, not really. I was just trying to. I want to rob him. him. <laughs> well, anyway, thank you. I want to rob him so hard, chat. You don't understand. Alley oop. These women are easily impressed. Yeah, well, TikTok didn't exist yet. Do you know what I mean? Turning into a regular old fairy godmother, there, Arthur. What's that supposed to mean? It means you got a heart. A small one, perhaps, hidden deep inside, but a real one? And you haven't, your pulse of old lizard. Lizards have hearts. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. To be honest, if you lot hadn't been here, I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> <laughs> well, you did it. <laughs> We're gonna do a try a try a high honor playthrough, yeah. why not? God, this game is just gorgeous. Love the trains existing as well. So alive. Woo! Smell those sheep. <laughs> or is that uncle? <laughs> oh, very funny. Already shot one person, Jay? Like yeah, but uh, criminal. Other people. Finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. 
Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. Or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. Well, Gobble, I know somebody in Ranch okay. who is going to be doing tours Take soon, good, so... Around, See what we Maybe. <laughs> I remember... I just remember my mind Go being blown. When I was like, how is there's a puddle in this mud? On the right. How? Well, how? You pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. <laughs> yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> Ooh, yes. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. Let's park up down the end there, near the stables. Mm. I'm not sure you're taking us the right way. It's called reverse parking. It means it's easier for a quick getaway, you dumbass. You sure this is the direction? All right. Here we See? are, just like I said, the cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man at his finest. Uncle. Oh, I'm looking for fancy. Look at me. Well, we're going to do what any self respecting maniac does. Put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. <gasps> we'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble and don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Donations Come for ladies. the poor? Uh. Paris. Come on. I imagine Paris and Valentine So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one shot kid. <laughs> I just mean you okay. come quickly, that's it. That's all I'm that means. Ask why. You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. Slow and steady, right. chat. Slow Ringworm. and steady. Then rats with the plague. Then you. Shut up. This is the place, huh? Come on. Morning. So, what do you need? Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. You know, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Always thinking ahead, ain't you? Yeah, well, I got no money on me. Okay, wait for me outside when you're done. See, that's nice. Know you, have you know, they, so they, they, um... Uh, what do you call it? They put a line in if you came to the shop and you didn't have any money. Like, that's just nice. Oh, can I talk to him? Hey, you got a goddamn catalog here. Oh, shit, clothing. Mm -hmm. What else what you got? Let's see. Hey, right, who's this weirdo? Don't like him. Look, who's this? I wouldn't trust this man. What you got here? Oh, look at this. Oh, with the nerd. So, you're actually buying for once? Are you feeling all right? See this? Young folk got no respect for their elders no more. What do you reckon? The lamb or the sausage? Well, this here's a sheep town. The lamb's the best in the state. Now I know what the smell is. <laughs> well, that's a ripe cheese, all right. Oh, can I have some cheese? Can I have a cheese wedge, please? Please, uncle, buy me a cheese wedge. That looks like free tasting this. cheese. A jaw harp. What is this list of yours? I got a lot to replenish after that god awful time in the mountains. I just want some cheese. Ah, this should do the trick. Yep, that's fine whiskey. Oh, that's a smooth transition, isn't it? Oh, I'm tired, chat. Oh, because it's interactable, your eyes. So that's like a little. You can to you can touch health, this. My, sir. <laughs> It's a funny world, you know. <laughs> this time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house. <gasps> acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. 
train full of rich tourists heading to San Denis and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out in their new Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Karen? I think at the hotel, they were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? It seemed easy. <laughs> God damn why? <laughs> I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. Oh, there's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Excuse me. Get your hands off me. You thought I wouldn't find you, Tilly? Huh? You can go kiss a damn snake for all I care. Get off! Get your hands off mm. her, friend. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get off her. <laughs> or what exactly? I'll beat the shit out of you. We'll find out. You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with Go you. Go away right with now. Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. I go kill him, you know. Uncle, look after her. I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. I just want to walk a little quicker. Can I help you, sir? I'm looking for a girl who came in here earlier with a drunk feather, mid twenties, blonde. You'd remember her. Yeah, they're in two B upstairs. Are you uh, a friend of his? A friend of hers. Check the manager's outfits. Hey, yeah, just look, look how slowly he's like, man, no, I'm not in a rush. Boop, boop. No he's, he's, now, he's taking one step at a time, chap. Is there a way to take my half? Ah, Duke! Hey, hey, you! A friend of hers. Get out of here, buddy! I paid. Ain't paid a hitter, you goddamn animal! Come here! I paid for nothing. They... They... Ah. My time. What the hell are you doing here? Trying to play him. Not very well. Yoink. You okay? Fine. You sure? Yeah. Nothing. Oh, oh, just push me out Nothing of the way. Don't mind me. Man, but stupid bastard. We just do. Uh, right, only we just do. Uh, about the bank. I pick him up. Bank. Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but wait, he's dead. He's Why is he town. dead? There's lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Keep investigating. That doesn't count as bad though, chat. He's a woman beater and we knocked him out. I hope, uh, Cause you beat him to death. Okay it was like there? a one punch. Ish. You're gonna want to air out up there and that's gonna get a nasty smell. After you. Snapped his neck on the door. <laughs> Deserved it. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. Hey, yeah, he's dead now. Hey, who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Impossible. Listen, buddy. Come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Cool. Get. I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. Just yeah, let's go. Stay away from me. Get back here. Right I now. did open the door this time. <laughs> that would have been awkward. How you doing, Merv Dog? Yeah. 
Why are you telling lies about me? No, yeah. No, I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now please help me up. I ain't never been in black water. Then why are you chasing me? I've got an unfortunate face. Yes, yes, me too. Now please pull me up, please. I can't hold on much. All right, come on. God, this is all the boring options. But think of my honor chat. Think of my big okay, bar brother? of honor. No. No, I am not. I'm a mess. Now I just well, watch. Yeah, Bob, that's why I did my last playthrough. Here is that. I saved him, then shot him as he rode away. Jimmy Brooks. I think it's best for both of us. <laughs> that's exactly what I did. Happen. Well, I agree. You saved my life. You're a good man, and I, uh... Here. You want a pen? It's one of them steel ones. Yeah, thank you. I could stab a man in the neck with that. That's very kind of you. <laughs> but I'm not a good man, Jimmy Brooks. Not usually. You see, I was in Blackwater. I killed people. And maybe I should have killed you. Should I have killed you, Jimmy Brooks? Me? I never saw you. Not, not now, not, not never. I think we have an understanding. Of course we do. Jimmy Brooks. <laughs> I will remember that. I've got a good memory. I haven't. I haven't. Not, not one lick. Not one cent. Your old mind. Come on. Come on. You have a nice day now, sir. Yeah. Oh, it's so hard to play this game honorably. I, I hate it. Ah. Okay, girl. Uh. You can return the horse you stole to its owner in Valentine to gain order. Okay. This is hard, chat. This is really hard. But it, honestly, I need to try to do it with honor because it's the way most of my other attempts at playing this game went off the rails was when I just... Like, I would just walk in now and just murder the entirety of Valentine. <laughs> and then it just gets too chaotic too fast. Back, friend. Oh, you really were just borrowing. Yeah, I'm Appreciate nice it. like that. No, don't worry about it. I'm Arthur Morgan. Who oh, tell your friends? Be good for a change, Jay. I know, right? But I'm so good and holy in my normal life. Like, I have to get catharsis through hobo murdering in my video games, but I can't. Honestly, Bob, it's just trying to actually finish the game because I've never got further than... What did we figure it out? Like, chapter two, maybe? But also, now we're doing Red Dead roleplay. I was like, I really should try this again. But also, I'll be honest, Bob, now that I've got the 4080 graphics card, I was like, I wouldn't mind playing this with, you know, all the bells and whistles turned on. About to set some moss grown, you keep that up. I bet you blow that grass. I love it. <laughs> All right, there we go. Oh, Arthur. Arthur, come here, come here, come over here. I want you to meet our friends. <laughs> Pleased to wow. meet you. Wow. Well, you just a toughest teak mountain man. 
Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone can tell this one. I can is see a those mountains from here. Cat. Thank you. Exactly. Yes, he's a pussy cat. And that's all worth her. Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Wait, that a nice way to talk to a lady. Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. Excuse me. Well, well done, Arthur. You got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charmer. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man. I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey. hey there he is. Watch where you're going. Take it well, easy, Are you about pal. to kiss that guy Take or it punch easy, him? Huh? Oh, oh, and we have our answer. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Oh no! Ain't there no man in this saloon? Yeah. When grapple uses, uh, okay. Oh, in the back. Uh oh, the bigger boy. smaller boy you want some too oh huh? uh, no no thank you sir i've had enough Come oh dear on, pretty boy pretty boy you're kidding me pretty boy yeah you got him now make it a real fool of yourself all right come on Hey, I'm in the Come dirt. On. How dare you? I ain't even started. You okay there, Arthur? Yeah. I got this son of a bitch. F is such a weird okay, key for them to have chosen. Kill him, Tommy. Oh, no. That's a choke you son of a bitch. Hey, come on, stop that. Stop, stop, please. So please. much mud. I beg you, stop. Come, sir. You won the fight already. Surely that's enough. What business <laughs> is it of yours? No business. <clears throat> no business, sir, but please, I beg you. Making new friends again, I see, Arthur. Look who we found sniffing about. Josiah Trelawney. The very same. <laughs> well, I thought you'd gone to New York. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there. Seems. What a great accent. Ah, Javier and Charles, I've missed you. And Bill looking as well as can be. Gentlemen, always a pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him. Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater... Uh, ah. Well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. What about me? 
Well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill. Come on. And dunk. It's time for a bubble bath, Mr. Morgan. You want me to clean you up? I want a proper clean. Oh, wait, is there some looting to be done? There's looting to be done, chat. Wait, hang on. Does this count as... Is this dishonorable if I loot one of these bodies? I also need my hat back. Yes, oh, okay. So they have to how do you how do you know if it's an innocent body or not? I don't even know if this is my hat, I'll be honest. Holy hell. I don't think I've ever actually been to the little hotel down here. Why are you running away from me? Innocence town focused. Ah, uh, okay. You arrange a bath, I need a wash. I got someone warming it up for you already. Just head down the corridor there. Oh no, chat. Is it about to get sexy? Is it about to get sexy? Why is there a, a mewing cow or something in this hotel? There's time to get my sexy on. Oh my. Oh my, oh me, oh my. Oh yeah. Scabba-da-boo, ba ba doo bow It's just me, Arthur the Morgan. Scrub a dub dub. I thought you could get, couldn't you get someone to come in and give you a wash? Or did I, am I just imagining that from, um. Can I be of any oh. assistance in there? No! We're five cents short of a deluxe bar! <laughs> oh no! Maybe another time. Okay, maybe next time, hon. She sounds hot. God damn it. Chat, somebody give me 50 cents. I know I only need five cents, don't I? Uh, to be five cents richer. It's actually, to be honest, you can role play quite nicely in this, um, in this game. What happened to all the money I looted? I donated it to the camp. Like a good boy. You tickle your pickle for a nickel. Was that just a man crying upstairs? You can stay another night if you want. I mean, I haven't said a uh, first night. Okay. All right. Goodbye. I, this confused me last time I played this game, right? They basically abandon you in town. Like, I don't have a horse. And they've left on the wagon. Which always confused me a little bit. But there's a white area over here. Oh, I think I remember there's a the mission over here. How did this clothes get clean? Uh, plot cleaning. Yeah. Hello, yeah, sir. but my horse is at camp because we came on the wagon. I remember this last time I played this mission in Valentine. I was like, this doesn't make any sense. How you doing, friend? Yeah, I'm all good. Thank you. No. Oh, no, wait. It's okay. We can't. We do have enough. We do have enough money to chat to the, the veteran. Yeah, I probably could. I think if I whistled for the horse, maybe it, maybe it would come up. Just wanted to walk just a, just a tiny bit faster. I don't want to run. Give a fellow a nickel. Hey, brother. Hey. 
I'm too old to get a job, mister. Way too old. Can't we be friends? Hang on, wait. Is this the racist side of the Civil War chat? I think we get honored for being friends though. No? Okay, fine. He can have some money. I'm so happy. I ain't had a friend in a long time. Long, long time. My last friend died. It weren't my fault. They said it was, but they was wrong. Aww. It's fun being with you, mister. All right. Can I hold you a second, mister? Can I? Hi on a playthrough. We're doing it, Jack. Okay, just quickly. That felt good. It's nice to be held sometimes. More honor. Oh, we used to hold each other in the war. Mm. You got sad eyes, mister. Like you've seen sad things. Remember with kindness. Thanks. Oh. oh. Oh, okay. Partner? Partner? <laughs> you discovered a stranger. They are marked with a question mark and will give you tasks to perform. Excellent tasks. My favorite thing. Oh, wait. On, Welcome Try on the adventure. What really happened at Sylvia's Saloon back in 76? Just a lot of bunk, Plato. It's just a lot of bunk. It's not bunk, Mr. Who's Calories. your friend there? Put that in your fucking book, Plato. This is Jim Boy Calloway. The Jim Boy Calloway. Who? The gunslinger. Fastest left-handed draw that ever drew breath. He once killed 14 <clears throat> men God in a damn. fight in Lucy Hollow. What are you waiting for? How do you mean? Well, I reckon right now, kill him yourself. I don't want to kill him. I did do this I mission, Hentai. I don't know if I did He's all of them. God. I think I definitely did two of biography. them, I think. How's that going? I think I prefer the duel. Either I'd kill him and be able to be Baltimore's finest ever gunslinger, or he'd kill me and I could be set free from ever having to speak to him again. Well, you're starting to understand something very important. What's that? The joys of gunslinging. It's win-win. Freedom or glory. That's brilliant. I'm going to write that down, if I may. Be my guest. <laughs> What's your name? I don't have a name. But you are a Ryan. gunslinger? Not really. I mean, folks who need shooting, I try and shoot in the back. All that other stuff. Oh, uh, wait. Well, Welcome on the But you fought you. duels. Once upon a time, I may have. And you ain't interested in fame? <sighs> I don't think so. Strange. But you like fortune. I need money, sure. Okay. And forgive me, mister, if I seem a little desperate. I am a little desperate. This book... I've got to make a thing of it, and, well, there's a whole list of gunfighters. Legends, every last one. Emmett Granger. Flacco Hernandez. Billy Midnight. Black Bell. Never heard of him. Maybe you can go and speak to them. Oh, good. Ask them about Callaway. Any of them get uppity. Shoot them. <gasps> I can't believe I just said that, but... You want me to go and find some... Sad, deluded fools like him. Ask if he was the greatest, and then if they get uppity, shoot him. Does sound a lot worse than it did in my head. How much you paying? Well, a lot. Half the proceeds of the book, if you help me get it written. I'll see what I can do. Ha! Oh, get photos. Okay. You're into some kinky and there are notes shit, on huh? The back of those portraits that should lead you to him. <laughs> I'll see what I can find out. I imagine we'll be stuck here upon your return. Yeah, bring me pictures of the corpses, please. Hey, Dutch, I met some weirdo. He wants me to take pictures of dead people. Didn't really explain why. All right, what do we got left on the map around here? Okay, let's try the magic. Um. Not again. Yeah, I don't understand. Like, they do literally just abandon you in the town and you have to walk all the way back home? Weird. Oh, I might have a cup of coffee after stream. Decaf coffee. I'm not, an, I'm not insane, Jad. Hello there. Hey, howdy. Howdy doody. 
Well, I donated all my damn money to camp, PD. I want nicer lodgings. I want Mr. Pearson to have leather working tools. Is that okay by you? I would like to look very pretty when I'm beating people up. Jesus H. Christ. Oh. Raspberry Jam! God damn it, thank you for the follow. Arthur Morgan. All right. I'm just chilling out now. We're just going for a wander. I remember the game tries to teach you about jewels at some point, and I just, I just got it completely fucking wrong, and then they never give you the tutorial again, and I was fucked. You should get Arthur, Arthur some fancy new clothes. Well, once we get going, we get some money going. I, I tend to like to get the camp upgraded. Don't really know why, to be fair. Ran across a parcel of locals the other day. They won't forget the O'Driscoll name anytime soon. <laughs> So when we getting back out there? I feel an air of complacency. I can steal a horse? No. Yeah, well, anyways. I got a real thirst for some action. Well, alcohol and action. They're looking at me, but I'm like, I wonder if I could, uh... Steal one of their horses. Why are they staring at me? Okay, I'll, I'll go. I'm not gonna cause trouble in the center of Valentine. But I am genuinely confused that the game leaves you stranded with no horse. Hey, mister, give me a ride. Fine. Why am I going the long way? What, to the camp? This is the fast way. It's like right over there. What's shorter than a straight line? <laughs> I'm Arthur Morgan. Oh, do I not? Do I have my, um... Okay. Half a straight line? That's true. An optional mission is now available. Completing them can be a way to gain honor. Okay. Eh, 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 eh. Oh! Oh, well, that's nasty. Right, can I cut it down? Look on my works. I don't, I don't want to. Okay. Well, that's gross. God, I mean, who am I tracking on this? Aha, uh -huh. let's go that way. Yep, there's some more bits. Man, 
know, we gotta put it back together. <sighs> I, fell, I fell down, god damn it. Okay. I don't like steep gradients. I told Dutch. Oh, actually, unless there is one, I don't think I didn't go to the end of that one. I don't think. I think I just saw that it ended and stopped. Oh. I also I don't even know if I'm supposed to find something that I can interact with. Uh, what I want. Hey, Arden. Yeah, that looks like an ear. We got a bit of a person there. How does this person have four ears? A big splosh here. Oh, yeah, there we go. Oh! There we go with a note. Yeah. Uh, mm, uh, oh, you poor bastard. Kick it down the hill. 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 Okay. Oh, I can't really see too much in the in this light. We'll have a look when we're uh, back in it. But we've got an Obi chat. We've got an Obi mission. Seven head. Can I just kick it a little bit? <clears throat> Fine. I won't kick the seven head. And if I remember rightly, like fires are good things to go and investigate like smoke billows like that surely you know don't you hentai or have you not played this game like that in depth okay I don't have my rifle on me but let's go see what's up here anyway Down, 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 da da down, down, da da down, do 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 do. See now I'm wondering what the rules are on ranch with regards to serial killers. Wait, is it gone? Did it literally just go, chat, when I got up here? The game hates me. Well, I guess I'll go fuck myself in the ass. Poor Arthur. He ran all the way up that hill. They saw me coming. Yeah, like, why's that guy got a head in his pocket? I think we should leave. Oh, I don't have my bow or anything. Hunt a little deer. How far are you gonna run, little one? Gone quite far. Oh no.
when you have to carry it back i think you can skin it here we'll find out i guess Oh, I'm gonna run out of stamina much faster than before I get there. Go. Ow! I forgot they did that in story mode. Get up, you useless shit! <laughs> I forgot they attack you in story mode. All right, fine. We're running home. I feel like. I don't know if I'm just missing something now that I should be able to get home a lot faster. Or like that I should have a horse with me or something. Oh, I think I know what it... They don't mention the patrols when they was talking up life in a gang. We gotta find something soon. I don't think you should just be wandering around here, friend. Not a thing happens around here without an O'Driscoll saying so. Understand me? Consider this a warning. Yeah, well, I never did like O'Driscoll's much. God damn old Driscoll's. Oh, look at that. Three bucks. Enough for a bath lady to touch my penis. <laughs> How far away did those horses run? Oh, okay. I think, I think they ran away to the point of despawning. Uh, you can use valuables in crafting, sell them to a fence, or donate them to camp funds. Okay. That's the new measure of the currency. Yes. Can it make a bath lady touch my penis? Consume yellow tonics to fortify your bars. A fortified bar can be used for a short... There's just so many mechanics to this game. I think... I think that's why I got so confused with this game initially. There's just so much to it. Okay, that we can skin. I got some plump bird meat. When you skin, it's me, Bill. Man coming in. Look who's back. A man. I've punched people on accident. And the thing is as well, I don't know if you found this uh, hentai, but because the game is so cinematic, I hate it when a cinematic moment gets ruined for a stupid key fumble or because you're like shit which mechanic uh is this that i'm supposed to remember and do now under time pressure uh oh dear i've just got my lantern out instead of done a duel oh there's my goddamn horse yep just put your lit lantern yeah in a minute how's that this is a strop walk this is look at this I'm in a mood. I'm going over here and I don't want anyone to talk to me. <laughs> Bring pears and animals to supply the camp. Um, he can use the meat for food and the skins to craft satchels. Okay. Oh, I think I have to get him right, tools. Don't forget, I'm more than happy to craft you something if you bring me the right materials. Okay, purchase leather wagging. Okay. All right. So he can't do dick till we got him some upgrades. I, I need to get my hands on some a stew without good meat is no stew at all, Mr. Morgan. Um, oh, hentai. I don't know if you were here earlier. Um, 
Do you remember what the difference is between donate all and donate for funds? As long as we have a bit of money for the bath lady, yeah. Designer purses, yeah. Um, unless it's just like, is this just letting us do it all and that's just doing it one at a time? I guess, maybe? Oh, okay. So that gives us donate for provisions. So I'm guessing donate all is donate everything. That will just get rid of the ones that are for funds. Just make sure it goes into the pot, and not your pocket. Okay. If you donate for funds, it will go to the camp for money. Thank you, Arthur. You're very welcome, Mr. Pearson. I think we've probably I think we've got enough money to do some upgrades now. Da, 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 oh, look at that. I wanna I'm gonna donate the pen from Jimmy Brooks. Why not? We don't I don't think we have the ledger yet, no. Okay, so we can't upgrade any of it yet. Oh. He'll use it for food and funds. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Uh, who do I want to go and see next? Chat, who should we do next? We've got three missions in camp. Oh, that's the next story mission. That's the next main story mission. La da -tum. I say I wants to talk. Kieran. Let's go and talk to the little shit at camp. Egg sandwich. Ah, oh, fuck yes. Da da dum. Da 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 dum. Da 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 dum. I can't stop. Oh shit. When did it get to 10 o'clock, chat? All right, I'll talk to Kieran and then I need to Please. stop. <laughs> Speak. Don't cry, boy. Speak about your gang. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> boy. Whoa, hold your horses there. Oh, no, I I've triggered a full mission. A cat has got our friend here's tongue. I was thinking Mr. Williamson could have a word. You ready to talk, boy? I told you, mister. I told all huh? of I don't know nothing, okay? They ain't no friends of mine. I just been ridden with them for a Horse while. Horseshit. You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the next time he opens his mouth, it is to tell us what is going on. Ah, uh, <laughs> who am I kidding? One of O'Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth, but he'd tell a lie. <clears throat> Screw it. Let's just have some fun. <laughs> Geld him. Oh, yeah! You nook! Where's he going? Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. Just gonna cause you trouble. <laughs> you know, in Imperial Rome, Eunuchs was among the happiest and most loyal of courtiers. No, you're kidding me, right? Of course. You sick bastard! Oh, what do you want from me? Well, you are gonna talk. The only question is now or after we got these little fellas off. Okay, okay, listen. Hi, I know I, I... where old Driscoll was holed up. And you're right. He don't like you any more than you like him. He's at Six Point Cabin. Oh. Uh, I'll take you there. Serious, I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you. No offense. Oh, none taken. Okay, then, partner. Uh, Why don't you take a few of us up there right now? I got this, Dutch. Should be fun. All right, you. Come on. Hey. Let's go. <laughs> Gild it. <laughs> Gild that son you of a bitch. Trying to trick us, O'Driscoll. <laughs> I... So I don't actually know. Can I save from here? Story save. Oh, currently unable to manually save. Did it tell me where my last one was? Load game. Auto save 1004. Okay, so that must be just before. Oh, look, there's my old save chat. There you go. That's however I got. That's wherever I got. I'll delete that one so I don't accidentally load it.
Okay, I'll just keep that save. It's from four minutes ago, so it must be just before I I triggered the mission. All right. All right, I'm coming back, chat. Don't miss me too much. Oh, hi. It is me with my face. Um, hello, anybody who might have been watching, by the way. Um, new to my channel, but like uh, Red Dead Redemption. Uh, if you like Red Dead Redemption roleplay, uh, I do also have another channel which is Britain RP, where we just do uh, Red Dead Redemption roleplay on a private whitelisted server called Ranch RP. Um, so I'll go maybe check that out if you like it. Uh, now I have to wait, obviously, because uh, some idiot decided to make me an orange and I can't do my outro because I can't actually see any of you. Yeah, I close my eyes when the orange is on. Yeah, I close the eyes. I close my eyes. Uh, chat, I next weekend is uh, next weekend. Next week, I'll be honest, is a shit show because um, I have now been booked for a session Monday night, so I won't be around to do a stream Monday. Uh, let me check the calendar. I'll put the schedule up anyway, as always, chat. But um, so yeah, I can't stream Monday. I will stream. Fuck. Oh. Okay, so Jesus. There's going to be a Red Dead Redemption stream on Monday on the RP channel. Uh, oh, possibly. No, there probably won't be. I want because I've got I can't wreck my voice. So there'll be a stream. There'll be Pen Dragon on Tuesday week off. <laughs> there'll be Pen Dragon on Tuesday, and then that's it, chat. I'm away for the Baftas Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then I've got my kids, uh, 13th, 14th, 15th. So I might get a Red Dead stream in uh, Wednesday before we leave for the BAFTAs, but it's probably high. Fuck! Oh, wait! No, Jack, it's fine. I can do a Red Dead stream on Tuesday before Pendragon, so at least we can get that in. And then, yeah, then I won't be back for another another Tuesday. Oh, no, chat. Don't forget me. Don't leave. Adding any VODs? How do you mean, Qs? Just remember, you promised to have some Korean barbecue while in London. Why did that happen? I don't believe that. I don't believe that at all. Uh, missed this morning. Uh, I don't, to be honest, I don't even know if I'll bother putting today's VODs up because like literally nothing happened. Um, like I can, but honestly, literally nothing happened. There's like an hour and a half maybe of Obi just riding around. And then about two hours of scooter just gold panning. <laughs> I don't even think we really got any RP today. Um, but I do need to catch up and get Obi from yesterday. And I'll put up today's anyway, I guess. Um, and then obviously this stream will be will be up. Put them on. Consistency. <sighs> Fine. Whatever. Right, chat. Let's go and see uh, who I'm going to dump you on. In a very caring manner, of course. Don't forget all that hot porch content. All that hot porch content. I know, right? Uh, who is on? I'm going to drop you with Galethril. Why not? Hold on. Forward slash raid Galethril. I did it, champ. I did it. Have a good weekend, everybody. Thank you for the mid subs, follows, all the usual gubbins. Come join us in the Discord. Uh, I'll see you on Tuesday, chat. I'll see you on Tuesday. Bye. Oh. There'll be some Red Dead streams over the weekend over on the um, on the roleplay channel. So there will be some streams over the weekend, uh, but over on uh, over on this one. Okay, there you go. Bye.